The views, comments, and opinions of the following program do not necessarily reflect those of Morris Media Studios, MorrisMediaLive.com, or its affiliates. Listener discretion is advised. Huh? Shout out to rehearsal. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 no. Hey, man, this is coming. I thought Danny wasn't going to be here, so I just invited somebody. Four mics up here. So what was she going to do when Jeff came in? So what was, what was she going to do? So when Jeff didn't, Jeff came in, what were we going to do? I'm done talking. Yeah, about yeah, now, yeah. Now you get, now you sensitive. You should have left with her. If you going to get sensitive, shoot, we on? Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> you guys weren't privy to what happened. Uh, again, uh, it's my I, fault. I think you have to introduce yourself first. I'm a little frustrated. <laughs> Flustered. <laughs> Flustered. Someone was rude. Uh, I'm Lewis Dix. TDP. Speed Doggy Dog. Jeff Arnold's five minutes out. There was someone else here. <laughs> Um, so what happened was... Let's not do that. No, was it so funny? No, no. Well, so that. I'm not going to say any names. No, let's just not do no, it. No, that's, that's you. when do you start telling us what we can do and can't do? You do I you. I let's not. All right, I there you go. I don't do. All right, Danny. <laughs> I mean, man, let's not talk about what just happened, y'all. We, shh. Okay. Hey, great day. Oh my God. It's Thursday. Um, yeah. Sensitive, just sensitive. 18th. Uh, All right, I'm going to put it out this way. This is our space. If you're ever in a space and someone comes in to your space and just decides to sit down, no in introduction. Space. In your space. In our space, yeah. no introduction. How you doing? Hi, guys, whatever. And it's a female. On a, it's a man show. Waiting for Jeff, who's four minutes out. Who's a female. Yes, <laughs> that's that's his seat. Learn. I say, hey, excuse me, that's, you can't sit there. You got to go back. Go, please sit down. And wait. You're that's a little not stronger than that. You had more. I was like, hey, you need to you sit. You can't come in. You can't. You need to yeah. sit back. That's not yeah. your seat. Please. Yeah. All right. He says, that's my guest. I invited her. Okay. So they still have to wait to be introduced. They put their water bottle and all that stuff there to take Jeff's space. I say no. Then that person gets sensitive. And says, oh, I'm leaving. Bye. And my thing is, well, if you couldn't handle it, that was so rude. Okay. Poetess, that was rude. Okay. That's what you said, P? Oh, that was rude. But but bottom line, nobody How else. How about him being late? No, okay, here there, we go. That's rude. Here you go. That, well, that's who he is. Oh, okay. So we'll see what he I've thinks. I've never been late before. So but let's see, what, let's see what he thinks. This is the we deal. Get, we can get rid of the word no, never. No, sit down. Sit down. <laughs> let us say. Let, let us, that go. Let, Scratch uh, that off. Let's, let us. You tell us. You got you're, that you're, off your bucket list. He's objective. Okay. He, he wasn't here. He wasn't here. So this is what happened. You weren't here. TDP walks in. Who? Well, uh, first of all, lower your voice. You're not kids. Did you, you shave your little John? <laughs> you little John. You coming in all. Oh, 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 oh. What kind of relaxer are you? Used? Just because you mm. saw Danny. I see you got the pullback. I see you got the pullback. Um, no, I have to relax. <laughs> it's just years of training. <laughs> Down, boy. It's called a beanie. That's what it's called. <laughs> so, um, okay, so, where are we at now? so, 
Speedy and I sitting there. We ready to start the show. Start the show. Okay. And TDP walks in. As he should. And we look at your thing that you're three minutes out. Okay. All right. TDP walks in with a female. Oh, wow. I thought it was a comic. I didn't know who it was. No. All right. So TDP sits down. He introduces her to poetess. Don't introduce her. She starts coming, puts her stuff right at your seat. Oh, wow. I yeah. said, I was like, hey, no, 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 no. He was you, almost out of here. I'm like, no, you need to go ahead and, and, and sit there. That's somebody else's seat. You can't sit there. You need to go sit there and wait. Oh, oh, that's rude. That's rude. I'm leaving. Bye. Oh, okay. So he, he stood up for you is what he, he said. He sort of took up for, oh, I, I, I was like, who invited her? My, that's my friend. I invited her since Danny wasn't going to be here. Okay. Now, all of a sudden, I'm rude. <laughs> well. And so she leaves, and then you ran out to try to stop her. No, right? no, I went to the bathroom. Okay. Hilarious. Okay. <laughs> 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 nothing yeah, has to do with that. No. <laughs> so he's threatening. I still want TDB to meet my friend. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Might need a ride. Yeah, he, <laughs> he says, I'm, I'm leaving. Okay, bye. <laughs> oh, he said he's leaving? Yeah, I told him we already know his jokes, so we good. <laughs> oh, wow. So, um, well, and then the person leaves. The person me. leaves. But my thing is... The person wasn't introduced to us. She didn't introduce herself. She just starts sitting her stuff there like she was going to sit there. To me, that's disrespectful and rude. Okay. Now, what's your take? I mean... You were late. Yeah. So, was she going to be a guest on the show? I, I'm assuming so, yes. Okay. Well, did she have an opportunity? Was uh, like... No, that, that was nipped in the bud. Eh? Well, no, we I mean, were not she... told about it. Yeah. At all. Okay, so he just brought her. Yes. Okay. Well, he right there. You he, saw in the chat. He y'all talking said like he left. He needed the address. <laughs> I said it was for his parole officer. Oh, okay. That's why. Well, I mean, he's in. He's entitled to bring a guest. He is. Okay. He, I'm yeah, looking yeah, at you, him. You're talking like he ain't. So how should he, should he have introduced his guest to us and told us? When he first came here, yeah. Why should, should, should she have been comfortable enough to just come take your seat or that open seat? Well, no one's comfortable to take my seat. No, well. she didn't know it was your seat. It was just an open seat. <laughs> well. Without being invited. Okay. Poor to say it. Okay. <laughs> See, that's my thing. So, okay. you know. So how do you feel about it? You got a zipper on your sleeve. Go ahead. It's supposed to be. <laughs> Go ahead. What's your feeling? So you dope right <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she's gone now, so we can move well, on. Well, is she? Yeah. Or is she in the car wait? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> you need a ride? <laughs> well, at least you won't get a ticket. <laughs> <laughs> and, and so I'm, I'm like, man, you know what we do here. So if you didn't even tell her what we do here, that's rude? Oh, she's in for a rude awakening. Okay, well, can we call her back in? Can and we summon her? No, no, and we got a thing about women being on the show. Who's the only female that's been on this show? Hope. Thank you. I mean, and Pam. And then we realized that Nikki, well, Nikki Pam, she, she really do a this. Well, she do this shit. Yeah. 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 Speedy alternates sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that you knew that word, I'm impressed. <laughs> <laughs> Alternator. That's what I thought he said. All right, so I'm Lewis Dix. TDP. Speed Dog. Oh, shit. Oh, Go ahead. All right, Dan. And, hey, I'm Lewis exactly. Dix. TDP. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Jeff Arnold. Speed Dog. Why is dog. my chair wobbly? Because someone she was said it. <laughs> what happened? Can't put her in that chair. <laughs> and it's, it's so funny how I'm the rude one. People don't. Well, like you me. can be rude. Look, true. Yeah, do you, you know you, you, Lewis? Yeah. Do you look in the mirror? Yeah, you very rude. You ain't, okay. you ain't no walking. So in the now park. she doesn't like me for any like, reason. When I introduce you to people, I don't Lewis, even know her name. I, I have to explain you cute? ahead of time. Huh? Was she cute? You know she was kind of cute. That's why I was rude. <laughs> if she was ugly, I would have said nothing. It's like, hey, sit down, dude. <laughs> <laughs> hey, homie. <laughs> Yo, bruh. Hello, you've been doing comedy. <laughs> hey, 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 what's up, homie? Yo, Dot. <laughs> <It's not hysterical. laughs> so, no, no, She Lou. was kind of cute, but she, I mean, she looked interesting. Okay. So you, well, you know, when I introduced you, I, I've already told them who you are and that you're a little rough around the edges. That's my But point I said, with him. Lewis is Lewis, and he's going to give you oh, he, whatever that is. No, he's he just rude. That too. No, yeah. no, but, but if you're so going to bring, some, if you bring somebody in here, you would warn them what kind of environment oh, yeah, they're coming in. Oh, yeah, most definitely. He did not. Him. Yes. Teeter. So no, whatever no, power she, my here. point is this here. whatever <laughs> power she like has that. over him, she felt she had over us. Oh. That was my feeling. That went that far? Yes, because she wouldn't have acted that way. She would have given us the same respect that she evidently is not giving him. Well, not, not Are you no, I'm just no, I'm just saying. You put more on it. No, because all right, I'm thinking if I brought a woman in here, if mm. Code Three came in here, well, that'd have been surprising. She would me. she would act accordingly to. Because you would have said. No, I wouldn't have was... to say. That's just who she is. Oh, okay. She definitely wouldn't. And this is the one somebody with a Glock on her hip. Mm. And she ain't shot two yet. But, yeah. Yeah. So I'm just saying, any one female you would have purchased in it, 
whatever she would have thought of you. Now we know, well, you got white girls, we know what they would have thought of you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> so that brings me to my point about what we talked about last night. <laughs> Y'all talked on with pillows? No, we went to see Dan and Green. Oh. And on the way back, I was no, we like, went to see some comedy. Yeah. That's true. Did you see comedy? And when we walked yeah, in, we Danon was on stage yelling. Yeah, he was on stage. Yeah, when his Korean suits on. <laughs> Did Cook Kim? Which, yeah, which by the way had his he name. He has embroidered his name. A name on he it. He wore suits? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, just a local, a, little, a, a local club? You know, he ain't in boxing shape. <laughs> yeah, he was sweating. So, yeah. His stomach looked big. He got, yeah, he got he got a punching bag. Yeah, he looked big. Yeah. But he was <laughs> working. He was. It was a great art crowd. He came button him two, you know, them two buttons. He came button him. Flex, I guess, went on first. It was at the Miracle Theater where it's, uh, oh, with Chris that, Spencer. Oh, that's right, yeah. We didn't see thing. Flex, and I've been wanting to see Flex. Because Flex said he's been doing comedy for a while. He said he started in New Hot York. York. That was he funny? Hmm? Was he funny? We didn't we, see him. We missed him. Oh. Yeah. And I, I've always that, thought that Flex got a somewhat of a pass here in L.A. Because, he, like you said, he was on TV, and he didn't really Well, his standard. pass was that he was a backup dancer for Queen Latifah. Yeah. Oh, and, and that's what got that's him. That's where he's from. That's mm-hmm. that's where he was. A, he was oh. a dancer. Well, for no, Queen. he said. No, no. That he, he's been doing comedy. Hey, no, he has. He could say that. Yes, he has. But his way in was he was the backup dancer for Queen Latifah, and and then they pushed him because I think he did Def Jam, and then he was able to get all the other. He stuff. had the same agent mm-hmm. as Robin, and yeah, that was gross. the point I was yeah. making in the green room that Flex didn't really go through what we all went through cracking on each other because we were in there oh, going hard on no, each other, no, 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 and I was like Flex oh, yeah. ain't never had you no. know. You said some funny shit about Wanda. That shit was hilarious. Oh yeah, it's Wanda White was funny. <laughs> I don't know if I could say that now. I'm not. I'm Who said talking it? about he said everybody. It? Oh my God. Oh, we were dogging everybody. You I said, say this, but I, I said, y'all back. I said, <laughs> I said, Edwanda's makeup is casket ready. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. It is a lot of makeup. Lot Hilarious. Of makeup. <laughs> See, it, and and that's why they never Chris dated women. With, hard Chris, yeah, Chris, like, no, buddy, oh, Chris, buddy, buddy yeah, like, buddy, like, Chris, start going. She got that um, from out of high makeup. <laughs> Was she there? Wow. Or she like, walked out. No, she wasn't there. Oh yeah, <laughs> you know. And then we cracked on Daphne Springs. She was there, and um, she funny. No, but they uh, Thomas Ward said something funny <laughs> yeah. about her. Yeah, Thomas Ward. What'd she had say? walked on stage, and she was like hesitant to say hi to everybody. Yeah. She kind of like because she, she was just feeling she herself. She always feels because they said she's doing well. She's a Facebook comic, and she's you well. Know, she's got dates. When she came and did. I don't know if you were there when she came and did uh, our show. And so we were like, okay, you know, tell, you know, we going we talk, we just, we don't have no, we don't have no paperwork. We just have fun and talk. And so we asked, oh, so who are you dating? She said, well, I didn't hear, I didn't come here to talk about my life. I came here to talk, because she was promoting something. Mm-hmm. And so Tangie got upset. Tangie like, well, hold up, you know, on, on air. She's right. like, look, uh, everybody here, we tell everything about ourselves. Right. Well, that's not what I'm here for. And I just said, okay, then I said, talk about what you want to talk about, then you go. And I never fucked with her again. Because oh, she wow. literally what, was acting like she was a diva. What did Thomas Ward say about it? He's like, she told me. Um, what did he say? He, he said, said one day he was introducing her at some event. Yeah, he did a show, yeah. And she told him what? She said, uh, make sure you don't introduce me as pretty. And she was <laughs> like, I wasn't. <laughs> don't even worry about that. <laughs> you got to go like this. <laughs> But um, so, but she's always been like that though. Right, yeah. she's always been like yeah. that. When you know, you know. So was she funny? She was good last night. I mean, she was. Good. It was a great house. It was hard not to be funny. Danon was funny. <laughs> no, and but but and Buddy Cri- killed. Be- Buddy killed it. Yeah. Buddy killed. And Alex Thomas was a star. Yeah. He's always. <laughs> He was telling stories that Jeff and I was like, why are you telling this story? Because he said, he, okay, maybe he can confirm this. He said he was a writer for four years in the first Prince. He said Will Smith saw him at a club and it's went up to him and he said. He did a warm up. That's what I was thinking right he away when he said Because you know, when he when did. When you said that, hold on, when you said, when he said that, your first facial reaction was your eyes just went up like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> let me go back to my memory. Like, right. Wow. <laughs> like, Shout out to Dubai. Back. Yeah, let me roll back. I mean, now. he was in tight with, with Will. Okay, but yeah, his but he first, first two years. Year, he yeah. said he was a writer for four years. He might have pitched a joke or two at the beginning, but he was warm up. That's what I thought. Remember I told you I think yeah. he probably pitched jokes. Yeah. I didn't think he was he's as, as he was, warm, he was warm up at um on um uh, Keaton, not Keaton, but uh Yeah, he's got the Wayne stuff going, down. Wayne stuff, yeah. But um are you doing that for a reason? Yeah. All right, well let's ask him. All right. Oh, he that's his say, Oh, hilarious. He knew you were gonna say something about his set. Oh, that's right. He heard oh well he knows. We came to see him. I don't go out. I got up and went to see him. All right, D, what's up? Welcome, D Green from Ohio. 
Oh, wow. Wow. Hey, man, hold up. Can oh, you hold, oh, cut him that's, off that's and bring him back on? And don't, don't, <laughs> yeah, don't turn, come turn on like that. Yeah, put your, your arm all the way back. Sit in a chair, that. nigga. What is he doing? Might as well be dude? doggy style. This nigga think he Egyptian lover. <laughs> <laughs> Only West Coast people are laughing at that. <laughs> Egyptian lover, baby. All right, try it again. Hey, oh, Danny Green's on the line with us. Shit, uh, <laughs> what's up, D? Yeah, you got I'm Nietzsche Mike. No, I'll leave it where he is. I did, I did. What's going on? Where's the photo at? There you go. That's better. What's happening with you? Yeah, library is that better? Yeah. No, nigga. Sit up, man. You in the hotel room? <laughs> Grown ass man. Yeah, yeah, I'm in my hotel room. All right. Oh, so, so okay, first of all, you are what are you doing okay. in Ohio? Being gay. Well, I can't um I came back. Uh my trainer, my boxing trainer, Vonzel Johnson, he's retiring from the public library after 38 years. So I'm surprising him. And gonna go to his party tomorrow night. So you're gonna surprise a dude. Let's make sure we got that clear. I'm, I'm surprising my trainer. This nigga oh, okay. gonna jump off the cake. <laughs> hey bitch! <laughs> are, you, are you wearing that headgear? <laughs> Man, you guys are amazing. What's sure, going on? No, no, I'll make sure good. You flew all the way to wherever you are <laughs> to right, surprise a dude. Well, it's surprise trainer. my ex-trainer. It's not a dude, He's a dude. my trainer. He's a guy. But they've been through I'm gonna, it. They've okay, been I'm through going it. to surprise he's my he's trainer. He's one of my best friends. The guy y'all talk about. This dude. I would go fuck. Up. Let's get confirmation from that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, just, yeah. Can't confirm or deny. <laughs> he's just sitting there like, oh. Y'all are one of my best friends. Wait, hold up. Is he really one of your best friends? He's one of my best friends. We go I've back. Ne I've we, never we, known that. We go back. We go. I've been knowing T shit. Wait, 34 years. 91. Yeah. 90, I don't know 91. that qualifies yeah. as best friends. So no, we're best friends. Well, uh, in certain years. <laughs> Every odd year. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we can delete had a few the greatest years. joke in the world, but we can't say it. What? <laughs> His nigga had the greatest joke. What, just recently? Yes. <laughs> a few <laughs> seconds ago. So, <laughs> so Louis Bitch. Yes. Could you, you call back on your second? I, I want to thank, <laughs> I, I want to, I want to publicly thank you and Jeff for coming out and to the show, even though Jeff said he didn't come to see me, but I appreciate y'all coming out. See you. Well, I, that, that was I had me. a show myself. That's why I couldn't come see your show. because I. Really... No, you were hilarious, man. Yeah, I enjoyed you were. watching you. Yeah. You command the stage. You got great stage presence. Thank you, Jeff. Yeah. Thank you, Luke. Yeah. Appreciate and you did, it. And, you resp and the thing, you know, that's they like your about you is, you know, you, you didn't run the clock. You did your time. So that was cool. And, and I have to say, yeah. Poet has sat us down. And she said the fact that you didn't never had a family that we're your family. Wow. And she uh, she asked us if we would, uh, if we would work hard at just having you to come to someone and supporting you. So who you are you, never... Uncle V? There. <laughs> hey, uh, Daddy, I, I did not at least, say can that. At least pick, hey, can I at least I pick who I want in the family? That. Yeah, you can. Nope. You, you got to take us all. Yeah, yeah. Hey, <laughs> hey you took the it's ones that you adopted did. you. Yeah, you, you might, might as well take, take these. Yeah. <laughs> so we. Nah, man, it was a it was a good time last night. You know, it's funny. I wasn't supposed to go second. I was supposed to go third, right? But, but Daphne came in late, so I don't know if that you, was a you, setup or come not. On, but Dan, and you've been doing how long? You been doing stand up? Uh, nineteen. I started in nineteen ninety one. Okay, so you started. God damn! If uh, you've been doing comedy as long as we have, the first you, time I went on stage was in ninety one in Ohio. You, out here, we, we kind of got that when you said you first started. Yeah, first started. <laughs> uh, oh, you know, everyone, that everyone at this table knows that's what you do, so you don't go second. You show up late. You're not gonna get penalized. See, I, right? You know what's funny, but you know what's funny though. I didn't know, right? So Chris, so Chris was in the back, and Chris was like, "Is, she, is Daphne here yet?" Like, no. So I, I, I said, "Well, Chris, about to go." He's, everybody was like waiting, thought she was gonna pop up. So I went into the, you know, in the Miracle Theater, they got that other room around the back because I don't like to be around people. So I was there, and then all of a sudden they, they, Chris was on stage and said, "Hey, Dan, he'd be about to call you." So I was like, "Oh shit!" So she shouldn't pop up. So. She went, you know, I went on, but it was cool though. In those situations, I just leave the stage so they can't fire me. Motherfucker, no, you bring. Well, you know what's funny? The the um <laughs> the audience was the, it was it it was oh, a really audience good audience. It doesn't matter. The audience is hot, but that's just what some comics yeah. do. Yeah, right, yeah, so yeah. Smaller. So I, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I maybe I don't know. And you know what's funny? I think that could have been happy because you know the Elliot brothers. They give you their they give you the schedule before you go, so everybody knows. When they're supposed to go. Yeah, but if so she might have looked at it and be like, you know what? I'm gonna come about nine twenty five. Yeah, you know what I mean? I'm, like I'm bigger than him. 
Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. all right. Other than that, so you heard us. You, Thanks, were, caller. <laughs> <laughs> so, were you listening to the show? Give your information. No, I just got back. No, I just came back from dinner. Okay. So, when are you going to surprise the dude? Uh, his part. His event is tomorrow. Okay. What you going to wear? <laughs> A suit. Okay. The headgear, right? <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Now you think he's going to be surprised? Yeah. Like. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he was the one. If um, he's the guy in the picture with, with me and Muhammad Ali. That's my trainer. Okay, got you. Okay. And you haven't seen him what, in a few years or so. Yeah, a number. Yeah, the what? last time he came out, he came out for, when I had the premiere for my uh, DVD in '09. That's the last time I seen him. Oh, you saw him. In, oh, okay. That's so he don't have Parkinson or nothing, do he? No, nah, he could go. Okay. I'm you know who he is. You've heard of Von Still Johnson if you're into boxing. No. No, but then you guys didn't into it. He was a he only lost he only lost two fights in his whole career. Matthew Saad Muhammad and Michael Spinks. Oh, okay. All right, cool. All right, All right so listen, uh have fun, man. Be yeah, safe. enjoy yourself, man. Uh, Thanks, caller. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Call back if you want. If uh, listen eh. to the show. No, I won't. I don't want I don't want to. I'm, 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 I just wanted to call in and, and thank you guys for uh coming out and supporting. All right. Well, put your bid back on and lay down. <laughs> wow. Pass <laughs> your bedtime. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so, all right. Wait, wait, Danny, Danny. All right, he's gone. Yo. Right. Okay, okay, real quick. This is our question, so he can answer first. Okay. Because we were talking, Jeff and I were talking about what's the worst thing that a girl has said to you. Uh, oh shit! The I know that. You said to a girl. <laughs> you should have a list. So what's yours? <laughs> Nigga, you ugly. <laughs> Quit spitting on me. <laughs> that really got you. I'm drowning. That you know um, got. <laughs> when she told me. I, I was dating this girl, Impossible. and she she broke up with me because she told me she felt she would have to carry me because she didn't she didn't think I was gonna make enough money. To, and she said, I, "I feel like I would have to carry you." So how long? Had my credit wasn't good, so how, that was like how long had you been dating? We had been we were dating like about at least four months, six months. So y'all were serious. And I went to Vegas. I went to Vegas. I went to Vegas. And she had she didn't call me when I was in Vegas. I was like, why you didn't call me? Then she was like, I just feel like I would have to carry you. But she and then here's the funny thing about it though. Here's Stop the thing about it though. Questions. So we we went our separate ways, and then no, three months later, I, you know, because I, I liked her. So I called her one night, one morning, and she was crying. Got and it. I was like, What's wrong? And then she was like, She had lost her job. Uh, and then I went over there and I was like, you know, trying to console her. <laughs> <laughs> And then she, 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 I was trying to, you know, console her. And then she was like, I can't believe you're here. And I'm like, well, you know, I don't want to see you. You know, I don't want to see you do bad. And then she said, well, can I borrow some money? And I'm like, oh, nope. Uh, <laughs> wow. I still don't this. Yeah. wow. Nope. So, All right. Thank but you. that was the word somebody said. Somebody said, because, you know, as a man, you know, you don't want nobody Damn. You know, start talking about your, about your money. How long this All segment? Right. Thank you very much. We, we had, uh, just a question. Now, do you. Uh, my problem. Thank you. No problem. See you later, Dave. Now, do you want to tell them what you told me? What, what a girl said to you? <laughs> Thanks, Danny. Bye bye. Cut him off. <laughs> Not being rude. You are being rude. Do you want me I to tell? I was gonna say something like, you know, the worst thing a girl said to me is like, I wish I could say Happy Mother's Day to you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to. That wasn't a joke, but it was that other one was funny. As Which one did he say? <laughs> tell him, man. <laughs> what? He said, "Why are you down there? He's <laughs> down there looking for his mom." Was full of goddamn seat. <laughs> Gloria, <laughs> my Gloria. <laughs> Oh, 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 did he say now you're crying. Oh. Jeff said something last night that cracked me up. I can't remember what it was. But you that said was funny as fuck. Cracked me up. All right. Oh. So, do you are you going to tell them what you told me that the girl said to you? The I, I already told Speedy. The, yeah. Go ahead, say it. I forgot what it was. Go ahead. <laughs> no, go you ahead. couldn't. Your shit was trash. Oh, I couldn't fuck? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, oh, so you're so, in agreement. Yeah, she told me. Something. So what, what did she tell you? So how does that so work? So are y'all in the it bed? Yeah. After, yeah. No, it was like. In an argument? No. Oh, shit. I was trying to like, okay. Romance the stomach. No. <laughs> so it was one of them, you know, up. you were trying to, you know, it was one of the moments. You leave it to go and tell. You know, like, all right. Let me let me see what this is about tonight. Okay. And I called it up, and it's just like, what am I Did coming up with? Did you say the me? golden tail? Yeah. Old school. And so what now? And she was what just like, over oh, the she's like, what am I coming up with? She's like, you, she's like, you don't know how to fuck me. And I was like, oh, okay. But you had already fucked. Yeah. Okay. 
I mean, I bust fast. I was cool. <laughs> In the 90s, nigga, you was busting fast. I'm going to tear this. <laughs> <laughs> what you think, cool? <laughs> you know what an ice machine is? Hey, you man, hungry? I think, hey, I yeah, think we need to just talk. Yeah. Fuck. What the nigga say? Bitch, you want to cuddle? Yeah. yeah. No. I got mine. I'm good. I don't give a fuck. So, so, and she told you, so you called to see. I was just like, you know, what, no, what I happened do. if I remember? She, um, she beat me. Huh? And then, no, she, she with you. the beeper, with the beeper. Oh, yeah, I thought you. she beat the shit out of you. No, no she beat me, up. and then I remember I hit her back, and then I was just like, so what's up? And she's like, what you up to? And I'm like, nothing. I was like, so I'm getting ready to leave. You want to, you know, come through? And she's like, for what? <laughs> and I'm like, yo, so you know. For the trash? Yeah, she, yeah, she was basically, she's like, nah. She like, yeah, you can't fuck. I was like, oh, okay. Mm. You and took it just like that? You well, ain't go home and cry? No, how am I supposed to take you? Cry. <laughs> what, how you do? <laughs> yes, I can. <laughs> My mama said. No, nah, I'm like, it was cool. I mean, you know, it wasn't nothing but. Well, oh, it's kind of hot. Slow down. No, yeah, you, 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 just, you, it was nothing but. <laughs> apparently, you're, going, you're relapsing right now. <laughs> Turning into helium over there. Hug <laughs> said. Uh, she, she, she. <laughs> no, no, I'm cool. Let's take no, a breath. Just, Let's no, take a breath. Hold on. Cool. Hold I was cool with it. I, I know cool. we flashed right back to 91, yeah, but hold on. You couldn't have been cool with it. How are you going to be cool with that? You're going to gaslight me. I was cool with it. Oh, gaslight. Yeah, wow. I was cool with it. Trying to be young and, and old. We knew, and, and we <laughs> Learn. lost Learn. communication, and we didn't talk to each other after that. I was good. No, I was no, cool no. She talked to you no more. That you, was, you and cool. I was good with it. Yeah, I was good with it. All right, boss lady. <laughs> Would you ever I tell mean, a guy that? Back in the day. <laughs> Oh, yeah, pull this hell yeah. As soon as she get high. Oh, trash ass dick, motherfucker. Pull this? Definitely gonna tell you the trash. Because she did probably amped you up that it's gonna be hitting. And you, well, uh, I've been sucking on this sardine all night. Is this what you're working with? Really? It was wasting my time. What I yep. said to the sister. Oh, okay. Y'all must don't know pull this. I know. Wait, what's it? I do have a story. <laughs> okay, you gotta save it. Go ahead. Go ahead. So I went out with this guy one night that I've been talking to. Is it him? And dating. <laughs> Hell, <laughs> no. So we went and hit up a few bars, and I got so drunk. And he was drunk, too. And he lasted <laughs> two, less than two minutes. Wait, P, wait. And I cut <laughs> him And a what? It's and I cussed him out. A drunk cuss, too. <laughs> Punk motherfucker. <laughs> Where your dick at? And here's part he two. He never spoke to me again. <laughs> you think? And here's part two, because <laughs> I guess that night she had went out, we was at Boa. Uh -huh. And she had came back to Boa, and she was ranting about that. <laughs> that TDP, this nigga, I mean, I just... I just nah, uh, okay, this on. happened in... Uh, oh, it's another one. It happened twice. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Y'all ain't never thought I like how you put it. I was drunk. <laughs> <laughs> he was, too. Mm. Okay. So y'all right. yeah, and um and he never oh, and he never spoke to me wow. again after that. At, I apologize. I was. How do I you was, apologize? My bad. <laughs> you gonna do it again? No. I apologize. I felt bad. For what? Okay. I came here for this shrimp cocktail. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? Minute man. Was he a rapper? Mini sliders. Was he a rapper? No. Damn. Oh, wow. All right. So mine was. Oh yeah, your turn. <laughs> was the girl told me uh, your nose too big? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, meet in the wrong place. <laughs> You touching my asshole. <laughs> What's wrong with your finger? <laughs> that's not my finger. That's my nose. <laughs> you put your nose meat on your dick, you be all right. <laughs> your hair is falling out. <laughs> in my nose head. Now, all this happened. What's in this for me? <laughs> you so nosy. <laughs> so I can't be on your show? Fuck it. Uh, oh, cool. uh, oh, go ahead, Luke. What was it? Oh, yeah, you told me. <laughs> that, 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 that was rude. Yeah. So how do y'all expect us to really enjoy this if you niggas had already talked? Well, we was on the ride home, and I said, I'm going to bring this oh, up. Okay. And right. he said, and oh, I okay. asked him, because I was like, I don't know if we can really say it. Like, we were going to say, so who's going to be honest? No, I'll be honest, but finish it. Okay, yours. so, no, mine was that she said, <laughs> my joint was shriveled up too much. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, because we had been in the hot tub and uh, water. That was the excuse. Oh. So I was like, just give me a minute. Oh, my goodness. This nigga, he came with notice what? It was steam. So <laughs> fill me up. No, and then... And <laughs> So uh, then I kept trying to get so it. So you put, you try to get, you pull I it out. To, yeah, Wait, then I'm, I I'm sorry. You did clear. <laughs> you, you, you tipped it out. <laughs> you Three, two, one. <laughs> clear. So, so Three, I, you know, two, one. I can't it. save it. <laughs> so All right, so so you bought the hit. Tita, go again. Three, two, one. Clear. 
So you about to hit Lou? No, no, so we get out of the thing. Tub. First, we were supposed to be grinding in the hot tub, and it but, wasn't working. Oh, you don't have shorts on? Uh, no, I had shorts on, but oh. then I took them off. <laughs> well, you shouldn't have them. You're supposed to wait till it get dark. Right. <laughs> nigga done cooked this hot dog. <laughs> Messages. Uh, All right, go ahead. Three, so two, you out, one. You get out the t- uh, pool. Then we go up to the room and stuff. Go and up to the room. It's still wet. Tribble. Yeah. Uh-huh. So, yeah. So she, you know. All right. Well, let me try to help. So. Oh wow. You know, yeah. So she was yeah, mean. I, By then, my feelings was hurt. No, his feelings was hurt. <laughs> <laughs> it was a she. <laughs> no, man. You, you should. I wish they invented Viagra. <laughs> So, so you just she, he she, didn't she want to come out. It so finally like, came around. Oh, okay, it came around. Two and you, days and later. you killed it. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I think. Yeah, I did all right. <laughs> did, <laughs> did all right. <laughs> uh, so was you hurt? Yeah, a little bit, but I, I, no, I thought, let's not use that word. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> did you cry? No, I didn't cry. I just oh, well, felt no, like you had to cry. No, because I knew my joint was big because I had measured. Wow. It. Yeah. Okay, uh, and then we uh, went to another pr- subject. Yeah, uh, yeah I had measured. You met it on the, on the centimeter side <laughs> or the inch side. <laughs> You, you did an inseam look. <laughs> you use a thimble or a ruler? <laughs> no, I, I use a drawstring. What you? How no. many two picks did you line up? To? <laughs> no, so I knew I was adequate. Uh, well, so you know. well, not that nice. Yeah. <laughs> so okay, so can we so get don't confirmation. Do- can we call somebody to call in and verify that? Oh come on, man. Okay, that's gay. Mm. Yeah, really. No, um, a woman. Well, who gonna make the call? Okay, go ahead, uh, Teeter. Um. I was at um, Gardena Municipal. Oh yeah, playing hoop with the, rub- with the rubber floor. Yeah, the rubber floor there. Yeah. So on the rubber floor, you can get up, man. Everybody dunk. So we've been there all day. So I on, on the I way back, <laughs> we go to uh, Ramona's off of 135th and Western, coming out of Gardena. So see, young lady, I ain't seen in a minute. She was getting off the car, so I ain't tripping that I just went and played basketball. So I go up to her. She say, "Damn, nigga, you must be in her homegirls is getting out the car." <laughs> so my boy was like, "Damn, we just played basketball." I said, "Hold up, I got this." I got this. So let me tell you something, bitch. I done had bras look way better than you tell me I'm musty. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck wrong with you? Where you must? We just play That's ball. A ball. A cow. Was it bad funk or? We just played basketball. all day, man. All right, was okay. that basketball? Now you. Uh, Besides some white I girl was, calling you the N word, I'm sure. Oh wow! Oh, shit, Has that you've been with a lot of white girls? No, it, you I have. Haven't. I haven't. I wanted to ask Dan in that too. Dan is probably way more than me. Do you think if a girl, if a white girl, would that be a um, uh, what's that? You uh, be answering questions. Deal breaker. Deal breaker. Yeah. If she called you that, if a white girl called you that, a nigga. Yeah. I'd be in jail. You wouldn't hit it first. No. Well, she'd probably call you that while you fuck her. Fuck me, nigger. No. Mm. <laughs> anyway, I can't. <laughs> Just get uh, out the pool. I bust. Uh, <laughs> I bust. Just out the pool. So I'm uh, 12, 11, whatever, off of 88th and Normandy. Young, young lady on, on on the block who I thought was really cute. Her name was Stephanie. Mm. And uh, I asked her to was she. And, and I've been like, you know, you'd like somebody. So every time we she come out and play, I put her on my team. Get to the trauma. <laughs> <laughs> So she uh, she asked me. She said, would, "I asked her, would you you go out with me?" Mm-hmm. She said, "I would if you comb your hair." Oh, wow. <laughs> so I ran home, put some water in my shit, because I used to never comb my hair. And I comb my hair, come back out, and I said, "Now," she says, "No, I'm good." Mm-hmm. I was like, "Oh, fuck!" Wow. wow. And I seen her later in life. So you win. What that I bust back? Yours is the worst one. <laughs> That's pretty sad. No, it's not. Why are you raising your hand? I bust. Fast many times. Okay. Not so you still busting fast. Yes. Okay. The the pimp player guy. Yes, pimp player. And they ain't tripping. I wouldn't care. Cause they probably go to somebody else. Exactly. <laughs> so you like a college athlete? You one and done. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Shoot uh, my shot. I'm good. Okay. So how was your week? It was good. Made it to another trash week. Cool. So I'm good. How was your week? Speedy. Week is excellent. I just started doing uh, skinnies. I'll be hosting there from this point on out in the valley. So if you want to come, and it's free to get in for the comedy part. So I'm hosting oh, the comedy. So are you event. inviting us to perform? Yes. Or yeah, or come, come perform. Watch. Yeah, come. No, they don't come watch me. Do Who's skin- That's where Dannon just was, right? He had yeah. his birthday there. His mm-hmm. birthday party there. And where is that? On it. It's on Lancashire. Where it used to. Uh, well, the club is exact. 
across the street from uh, where the Ha Ha used to be. Oh, okay. The old so, Ha Ha. Yeah, where the old one used to be. Oh, yeah, yeah. So they're doing comedy now. What, what Not, days? Uh, every Wednesday. I'll be there every Wednesday hosting. It's free to get in for everybody until 1030. Um, what time does it start? Start, in, start the comedy at 9, but yeah, it's a workout room. So if you guys want to come, work out, have some fun, get cool. drinks, whatever. Okay. We'd love to see the fellas come through. Uh, that would be dope as fuck. See how you do that, Dan? That's how you do it. You invite people. You know. And it's free. How was your week? You said that. I'm alive. You see me? There you go. I'm alive. Okay. OJ gone. <laughs> Man, the juice. And they trying to take his, uh, you see they're trying to take his uh, estate. Oh, yeah, yeah, man. For yeah. sure. But they won't be able to get it. Because if, if you, you can get it when he was alive. Yeah, yeah. If, if you if you kick his estate up when he dies, then you can do that to everybody. They ain't going to let it happen. But yeah, they, they're trying to get the money out of his estate, <laughs> which is the money for his kids. 33.5 million. Mm-hmm. But That's you know what the rumor on the street was? That at the time of the murder, she was pregnant, allegedly, by Marcus Allen. Oh. Now, if you go back and look at the 30 for 30 mm-hmm. at the wedding, when they dancing, her, Nicole and OJ dancing, and you can see Marcus, he dancing with something, but he looking at her and he's smiling there. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I gotta watch it on the web. So they saying she was pregnant by Marcus? Yeah. Uh, it's another 2000 runner in there. Was it a boy or girl? <laughs> <laughs> it was a Danny. <laughs> <laughs> Still in the spit. So, so one of the things I was thinking about today, Hilarious. along with that, was what are some of the things your girls doesn't like that, that surprised you? And how did you find out? Like, all right, my thing is, I found out that Code 3 is not really, doesn't feel Michael Jackson. Right. We were riding somewhere, and I was jamming Michael, and she just right. wasn't feeling. I'm like, and it irritated me. <laughs> I'm like, are you kidding me? She's like, no, I, I, Did you turn I, it off? No, yeah, I put it on this something, another okay. song on it. But, you know, because I wanted her to enjoy it. But I was like, it's just like, how could you not like Michael Jackson? Were you riding in her car? I think we were. Yes, yeah, makes yeah sense. that makes sense to me. We were. You gotta listen to her music. Yeah. No, the thing is, her her motto is whoever's driving gets to play the music. Yeah. Do you drive well, when she's in the car? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah it's a Mercedes. I don't get to drive Mercedes. <laughs> you know, <that's> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Do you lean back? Uh, no, I don't lean back. She says I drive like Mr. Magoo. I sit up. So you don't move the che- seat or nothing. You don't yeah, yeah, I move seat, but I don't, I don't, I, I don't like driving on the freeway. I'm not a good mm-hmm. freeway driver. I'm a good street driver because yeah. in Philly we drove in the streets. But freeway, I, I just don't like going fast. And she, of course, is trained. So mm-hmm. she's flying. So she knew how to spin cars and all that. Mm-hmm. But she did. She was not feeling Michael Jackson. And I was like, wow. So did she say why? She just said, I've never, she said she, she's seen him in concert. She just doesn't, he just what doesn't. What song was it? Was I was playing all of Michael Jackson's. Oh, okay. And she just, I was like, even a Jackson 5? I was like, wow. Mm-hmm. You know. your nose reminded me. It's like that for people. <laughs> really? Do you have an artist that's popular that you don't feel? No, I remember one girl I went on a date with to Palm Springs, <laughs> and we had a good time down, and then coming back, we argued, mm-hmm. and she didn't like NDRE, and I played NDRE all the time. <laughs> all the time. I was petty. You are, yeah, you. I was yeah, petty. You're, you're always in my hair. <laughs> so, but no, yeah. I, I, I'm trying to think what artists that people like that I don't, I, I, I don't know. Mine is Luther Vandross. You don't like Luther? I like him, but it's like I don't seek his music. You mean you can't just jam, chill with Luther? I, I like a couple of songs, but I know he's great and everything. But it, I just don't Didn't get it. You don't get it. I, you don't a couple get it. Of songs well, which there. songs do you like of his? Got to be a house is not a home, which is not his song. No. Mm-hmm. Um, well, he covered a lot of last yeah. night. Yeah. Yeah. I fell well, in love. I like that song too. I like yeah. that. Yeah, that one. Like, that's good. Yeah, that that's one. good one. He wrote mm-hmm. all this. Yeah. What? But that's like that's like the only one. Like even in my playlist, that's the only song I have of his. Is that one. Wow. Yeah. No Luther. Huh? You? No, I, I'm I pretty much like music in general, so it doesn't matter what it is. Mm-hmm. And I'm really more into jazz because I I use jazz. If you ever want to remember something, play jazz, and you'll remember whatever you have to do that whole day. Oh, speedy. Oh, no, that's real shit. So I listen Crack to jazz code. when that's I got when you, I got shit to do. <laughs> I got play. I just play jazz. So that's how you remember all your kids' moms. Oh you just, wow! You just play jazz. Oh, oh, that's such a wow. song. Like it's thirty-five. Wow. All your kids' names. What's up, Jay? Put on some jazz. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's Brooklyn. Yeah, it's Brooklyn. Oh, it's your birthday. Oh, yeah. Be yeah. flat. Come here. <laughs> all right, all right, Ten. Jeff. Uh, I don't like today's music. I'm old school. You said artists. Like a single artist, everybody like, and you like. Oh, I'm not. I'm this. Not. I mean, it's kind of, 
You all right? You, you having a heart attack? What you do? He wants to come back to you? Yeah, I ain't no singer artist. I really just like, I mean, I like You like all music? Yeah, all kind of genres. All right, now, Boss Lady, you're in music. Is there someone that you... Yeah, I like you. I think this artist is great, and her music is dope. But I'm not a real big Sade fan. Mm. No. Ah. <clears throat> oh, okay. Oh God. I, like God. I know a lot of people. And I heard in concert she kills. Yeah. yeah. And wow. you know that's not her name. Everybody knows that, right? That's the name of the band. Yeah. Well, yeah. The band's name. Either way. So. Yeah. I mean, I don't think she cares. Not her she personally. Just, yeah. Right. Sade. I I she was actually the background singer and the lead singer. Quit. All right, Mr. Trivia. Okay. Um, I like I like Tina Marie. I can listen to Tina Marie all oh, day. Who yeah, can you listen to all day? Johnny Taylor. Uh, Marvin Gaye. Marvin Gaye, definitely. Marvin Gaye, yeah. Marvin Gaye. Mm. All day. I'll just say Ozzy Roberts. Okay, cleaning up your oh, house. What's your, who, what's your yeah. music for cleaning up your house? It has to be 70s, like Johnny Taylor. Yeah, yeah, stuff, stuff that I can sing yeah. to. Yeah, yeah. same yeah. thing. Yeah, seventy. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. What? Oh, what music do you do it to? Mm. And now me, it's well, it's, 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 it's but a it's, minute long. So. <laughs> <laughs> he does snippets. Remember snippets? You can get a whole CD yeah, full of snippets. snippets. <laughs> Go to me, number sixteen. <laughs> me, it's 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 Marvin Gaye. Uh, uh, let's uh, this the the. The album, um, since I had you, uh, uh, all you do it. You on the album? Yeah. It, it has since I had you. It's uh, oh, I want you album. Oh okay. Oh the great basement album. album. Yeah, yeah, I want you great album. album. Yeah. That's that's it. What's your what's your go to song when you want to get with you? you I, I go have to go with Teeter Isley Brothers. Just put their whole compilation. Yeah. The anthology. Just put a forty five on for me. Yeah. <laughs> it's, okay, uh, boss lady, what? Music, do you like to hear when Method Man? <laughs> <laughs> Raw Wu Tang Clan, yeah, Wu -Tang. the Nine Chambers. Yeah. You know what? It's funny. I don't want to listen to any music by any artist that I know. Oh, wow. <laughs> what? Wow. So you ain't going to get fucked tonight. <laughs> no hip hop. All instrumentals. <laughs> yeah. So get my jazz out. <laughs> exactly, Dieter. Will why, you why, stop it? Like, get up? Why is the that? Music? Why is that? I don't know. It's weird. I don't. I don't. So, know. do you stop the person and say, "Hey, can you go change it?" No. I mean, you got to already start with the vibe you're going with. So, probably jazz. Or, no, know, if I didn't know that, I'm gonna play probably somebody you may know. It might be in that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Have you ever been doing it and then you get up to change doing the it. music? Yeah, what's <laughs> you Nick doing? 10. Yeah. You doing? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> You know, you can say it. We've yeah, been fucking. Yeah, yeah, we right. fuck. I don't know what. Right? You have you ever been? Well, he a minute. Well, that was back in the day. I mean, you remember? Not would all you? The time. Would you have to? Because well, back well, in the day, you had the tape, and the tape would just automatically well, go to the other side. Back in the yeah. day, I had the five CD changer. Mm -hmm. So okay. I do Luther. I do uh, Isley Brothers. I would put in uh, Marvin. And, and the theme from McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I should have said it faster. This <laughs> because that's where we go when we finish. <laughs> <laughs> One of your hair just comes by the rim. <laughs> it was by the rim. <laughs> so what? 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 What did you? Did you put on gospel music? Shut up, man. No. Now I, I I used to fuck this girl, and she would play KJLA. So I went by on a Saturday night. Yeah. Everybody know if you go fuck on Saturday nights, so you got the it's playing mm -hmm. slow jam at twelve. I think one o'clock. It switched straight to gospel. Yeah, yeah, turn them on. And we yeah. fuck it. It's, May the Lord. Yeah. I said, God damn. And I didn't want to get up. But hmm. Really? Yeah, I didn't want to get up. You want to change the station? I'll be in there. Oh, wow. I'm not a, I'm not a minute guy. This weenie is Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Blessed he. Call her. Bus one for the Lord. Have you had sex with Speedy in his music? <laughs> 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 hi, hi, gentlemen. How are you doing? Hey, Seymour. Oh, it's Seymour. I ain't heard that voice in a minute. How you doing? How man? are you? I, I want, I want to make this very quick because I don't want to mess up your flow. So, like Jeff. But Speedy, yes, ma'am. But Speedy, always giving false information. He says so calmly. Which one? I thought Tita would step in. Which one? Sade's name is Helen Fala Sade Adu. Yeah, but the Sade band was named. Name. The but the band is named Sade. Why are you Sade? so defensive? Because yeah. I have to be. You said her. That's not her name. 
That is part of her middle name. You can Google that. Her first name is Helen, though. She might have put that on there. You don't know her. It's part of her name. Yeah, so. for this long, I'm going to make it my name now. Oh, okay. Um, Sadie? <laughs> How are you just, doing? Just, Thank you for that. I'm doing great, sir. Thank you for correcting so what's me. What's going on really quickly with your Trap House print hoodie? What's up with that? Oh, wow. What happened? Your, your Trap House hoodie. You don't like my the trap house carpet. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, wow. I like it or something. I don't know. Tied, I ain't working. I just want to make that quick correction. I'm going to get off the phone so y'all can keep flowing. Speedy, right. stop. No, no, hold on. Information. No, stop. What's the worst thing you ever said to a guy? Oh, get the fuck out. Uh, does it have to be like during sex or just no. period? No, no, just, just period. 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 Both. Yeah. <laughs> Bitch, you ugly. That'll get you a minute. That'll yeah, shriek yeah. you up. Oh, you know what, though? I just actually, uh, at Gremlin, there was this gentleman from my hometown, and bless his heart, he's married, has children now, so somebody could deal with it. He literally talked like he had a mouth full of whole roll oatmeal mixed with peanut butter. Uh -huh. You talking about Danny? I, I, I was just like, dude, I can't. I, I'm not an elitist at all because I'm a country girl, right? Mm -hmm. well, but if you dude, say you're not, that means you are. <laughs> you're not intelligent, and I can't communicate. You know, with you, I can't do it. So why did I you even not. go out with him? I was young. My bus pass expired. Need a ride. Okay. I'm like, like, hey, man, what's up, man? I can't stand it. I can't. I can't. Mm -hmm. I'm you with you on I that. I can't do it. I'm with you on that. I need you to okay. be able to speak, you know. You don't Expel. have to talk like a white dude, but I, I don't need you having that. And then like his thick tongue with oatmeal and peanut butter couldn't do it. <laughs> Bless his heart. <laughs> All right, see more. Oh my God, I'm a blessed one. All right, okay, see more. You ever seen her picture? Yeah, I've seen she's actually cute. Picture. Yeah, she's, she's cute, cute as fuck. Cute. Not, I mean, Dan didn't think she likes him. <laughs> oh, I could let him know that. Ain't gonna happen. <clears throat> yeah, that ain't gonna happen. Um, so, uh, okay, so. Uh, Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Say five 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 Nigga, you made me come all the way out here for this. Can we get the remix? Can we get the remix? That Come on. Fact. Growing. Growing up as a kid. Oh. <laughs> Have you heard the remix? <laughs> I want to start the uh, the um, poetry part with this. And welcome. Y'all remember this guy? Evening news. Here are today's top stories. Rent is at an all-time high in New York City. The average cost of an apartment in Manhattan is now a whopping $3,794 a month. Yeah, Critics say 5, Bloomberg has failed. Damn. Rent is too damn high. Y'all remember him? No, I don't even remember the People second. working eight hours a day, four hours a week, and a third job. What you gonna do with a lot of rent? Mothers can barely afford to feed the children breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Anyway. What's his name? If rent ain't too high in your state, something is Jimmy high. McMillan. I he, never seen that. I remember that. Anyway, his name is Jimmy McMillan. Okay. And he was running for mayor for New York. And his At campaign was rent is too damn high. That, that was his mm. campaign slogan. Mm. So I only played that because we know in L.A. now that rent is off the chain. Yeah. So recently our mayor, Karen Bass, has asked a bunch of corporations and celebrities and people with money to put into this program that she's trying to put together where um, they buy homes um, where people can, um, you know, be housed in low cost rent and mm. all of that. So. Because in L.A., um, seniors are getting kicked out and evicted. So yeah. um, oh, there's over 40,000 unhoused people in L.A. So she's trying her best to so come up with some Are they getting kicked program. out, the, not the senior homes? You're not talking about like No, oh, okay. like their homes. <laughs> okay, gotcha. If they don't own them, their homes. So here's a situation. Um, Latino lady. um her husband died, mm -hmm. and then she was getting his little money 
I'm say like seven hundred dollars, but you know, see, they had been in the house for a while, and then the people who owned the house died, and the kids took over, and then they raised because I think her rent was like eight hundred dollars, but then they raised her rent to eighteen hundred dollars, yeah. and she had to move. Mm. Yeah. yeah, it's serious out there. So, so this program is going is going to buy houses. Yeah, in they're what trying part? to, um, <coughs> you know, have them buy up houses to. Um, so, how do you qualify, or how would you qualify for it? I don't know. I think the program is still fairly new. They just they're just announcing it. So, so, um, in the chat room, how much is rent? What's the range in your area? Because in LA, for Maybe a one bedroom or even a studio apartment is like anywhere from fifteen to eight eighteen hundred dollars a month. Mm-hmm. It's quite expensive in my neighborhood. Yeah. Where you at? Off of Melrose and Fairfax. Mm-hmm. What is what is a one bedroom, two bedroom going for? The minimum I'll say twenty eight. <coughs> wow. For a two bedroom? Is that those new buildings or are you talking about old yeah. buildings? With no, the, old buildings. With the little cut yeah. out. Yeah. Air. The one it's a one bedroom across the street from me. Um, she's getting thirty nine seventy five. Damn. Yeah, easily. I mean, these young people. I mean, I guess <clears throat> they market it for the young people. Right, because they have. They don't think we we grew up with. I mean, I remember my first apartment. Yeah. Was, what was it? Eight hundred? No. It was four hundred. Uh, uh, was living on there? Aborn. No. It was no. Ab- I I was there first, and then I moved when I got married. And he took over the joint. Oh, yeah. It was what it was four twenty five. Four twenty five. Yeah. And I struggled for one bedroom. For one bedroom. Yeah, yeah, and it was a nice one bedroom. Yeah, 425. It was more like a condo. Yeah. It was a mm-hmm. condo. Mrs. Wheeler. So you live in a rent controlled building, Louis? Probably no, at that time. No, no, that was uh, at the time on yeah. Aborn. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this was like, but this was what year? The 90s. 90s. Yeah. 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 yeah, it was like, you know. And I struggled at that. That's when Lewis, Lewis, you couldn't even talk to Lewis, poet. Mm-hmm. Like, I would be like, hey, how you doing? Lou would be like, uh, you don't have a white shoes. Could you move? No, I spoke to people. No, no see, that's you don't remember how you were. No, I spoke to, I only had a couple friends. Mm-hmm. Let's just keep it real. That's why. I'm, no, I mean, that that's I chose about to be. four or five jobs. No, that, no I, I was work. I was locked in. So Robin Harris, I was studying. I was studying the comics. Robin, he was my friend. We were cool. We were, But you were with Fox. <laughs> so, we, were, we weren't, he wasn't Fox then. He was just... Jamie. He, he was Fox. I, I didn't really, I don't even know, if, did we ever meet? Yeah. Jeff brought you down when we was doing the, um, when they was doing the church comedy right there on La Brea and Fairview. Yeah. Was I rude to you? Right there. Yeah. Louis, you was rude to all the comedians. All riding. the comics was, didn't want to talk to you because you would be like, what? I, I can't, you know. If, if we had that's one-on-one, on one, if we had one-on-one, on one, I talked to everybody. I no. gave everybody the same so advice. So you don't want to hear what me. happened. Huh? No, go ahead. Go no, ahead. I'm just saying you don't want to no, hear. No, no, please. No, Lou. People were afraid of you. Uh, for what? Because you, were afraid you, fe- they were like, you, you, you wasn't friends. Asshole. You wasn't. Yeah, there. You I, I was honest, and it wasn't really a need for me to be friends with you if I didn't know you. Yeah. Because so, we were all hustling. So when Jeff introduced me to you at the right there on La Brea and Fairview, in a little spot, comedy spot, when you came in, Jeff was like, "Yo, Titty Free, this is Louis J." He looked you up and down and said, "Put your pants up, you all right. <laughs> and walked off. <laughs> he told me I need a white shirt. Did I say that? Yeah. Were your pants sagging? No. <laughs> <laughs> and then Titty replied, "Like you know, we're gonna rob that man. Yeah. <laughs> that what he said. <laughs> yeah, you know, we're gonna get him. Call her. <laughs> Do you like Louis? <laughs> uh, now, but when I started comedy, See? rest assured, Lewis, you were an erudite fucking Thank friend. you. Hey, guys. Hey, uh, Jeff. Uh, J- no, it's not a diss. G- just- All right, Jeff, so what no. do you mean? When, when we first met? Oh, okay, here's how. No, I was in awe of, of you. Everybody you was. Had comedy, yeah. I was. You had the comedy act. You know what it was like? It was like school days, and you was Julian, and all of us were pledging. Yes. And you yes. Were exactly. Like, like you were the, and, and it's real talk. Real talk when you think yeah. about it, because we all do belong to this fraternity. Yeah. And you were the older frat brother. Yeah. It's like, dude. It you was doing like, warm up you know, before everybody knew what the fuck that on. was. Yeah, I wasn't worried about putting these donuts on you. That wasn't the reason. I wasn't <laughs> scared. <Hilarious. laughs> that was. uh, yeah. uh, I didn't feel that way, because I was like, with Rob. You guys were tight. I'm talking about. I met him playing basketball. See, we we, we didn't get that. I didn't get that far to later because I know Fox was felt the same way. Fox was just like he told me I needed white shoes. <laughs> you told he told Fox. I that? was yeah, I was a, I was he a, told everybody that I was a, I studied that. comedy. I was I just into comedy. Yeah, I was studying the art. I was from theater. I was studying the art, 
Yeah, you were that, yeah. So I was I was just being honest with if you became my friend, you became my friend. Mm -hmm. But after every time we did stuff at the comic theater, I would walk home to Aborn. Yeah. I would walk home oh, yeah. and then and study Martin Luther King tapes. Them. Oh, see. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, Jeff. Uh, well, yeah, that was that was yeah, whatever that was. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, real talk, man. Real talk, Lewis. Take it, take it as respect. Because remember, we was all young cats trying yeah. to find our way in the fucking world. That's what we were. But all we knew, doing. we knew it wasn't gonna come through you, right? Like no, now, no, you, we you... were trying to figure out what you knew to get yes. around. Anyway, yes, yes. Uh, uh, I was calling first to say, God damn it, you two on the left look old as fuck. Jesus, give them some vitamins, uh, Lou. Third. This, there's Ooh, not... Well, who, who are you speaking of? Uh, Speedy and Jeff. You guys look like his uncle. You look like uncles. Look, I'm, <laughs> I, I, I'm calling it... Apparently, you don't have mirrors in your house. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, oh, no, come on. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Anyway, uh, uh, How old are you? there's not going to be any re relief. There's not going to be any so, relief. So it's going to get worse. Those, bruh, way worse. Way worse. Think about this. How is it that every major city in the country at the same time is gentrifying and developing? Here's how. Decades of planning for right now. Mm. And what's going to happen is already happening in New York. Pretty soon you're going to have to pay to come into the city. Yeah. The, cities, the cities are going to become these beautiful, sprawling metropolises of advancement and luxury and opulence and technology and everywhere else beyond the Thunderdome, nigga. That's what's yeah. going to happen. Yeah. So Welcome to Palmdale. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You go, let's think about this, bro. I went to, I went to court. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, yes, you know that you get picked up on a failure to appear on the weekend. Nigga, you ain't going to see nobody till Monday till afternoon. Till Monday afternoon. Yeah. Nobody, you in there. If they pick you up on a Friday, Bruh, you belong to the Friday system. Morning. Yeah. If it ain't you in the system. Anyway, that Monday, I'm in court. I shit you not. They are give this is LA County. They are they and you ain't you know, they don't separate traffic. You in there with the fellas. Right. Right. They're, they're, it's dudes with armed robbery, like real shit, that the judge literally was saying this. We will give you time served if you never live in Los Angeles County again. Like, wow. yeah, yeah, fuck it. Wow. In the paperwork, I should have kept it. In the paperwork was brochures for Lancaster, Palmdale, and Moreno Valley. Yeah. And that's how them yeah. dudes got out there. Wow, my, my muse says it. that, that they're just trying to eliminate the population. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. brother. Oh, okay, okay, I'll say this. Since we don't have to. Uh, uh, no, no, <laughs> but you, you're going to need this. This is for the reader, Speedy. Take a break. Uh, wow. Good point, look GB. Up, look up. Henry Kissinger, just Google it. Henry Kissinger, Agenda 21. It talks about the need to rid the earth of two thirds of its population. And if you just skim over it, you will watch the patterns and you can see where we are in the report right now. You gentlemen, move when you say right we, over. you're talking about black people. Uh, 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 all of us. Okay. We the people, the, no, the, people. Earth, the earth is not. To, Two-thirds of the Earth's population is not black. Two-thirds of the Earth's population is not productive at this time. Why do you think you have, why do you think you've been given YouTube and every tool to work with? So that this is your last opportunity to develop something. Mm. If you don't, fuck the rest of you. Yeah. That's where we're going. I respect you, gentlemen. Thank you for reminding me that the past three decades of my not, life has not been in vain. Uh, love for what we do. Talk amongst yourselves. I can't pretend I want to talk to you. <laughs> Jeff, I mean, yeah. Jeff Brown is a very smart young man. Yeah, he real with that because Henry Kissinger, I don't know, dude, now warmonger. Yeah. yeah. My muse says that all the time that, 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 that they're trying to eliminate the population. They're not trying, they're doing it. Now, let's go back to the fact that I don't think I'm rude. <laughs> that I, no, I, I'm still no, stuck on that. Not, not rude. On, you were. You were hard to approach, because because you didn't give off like, oh yeah, let me tell you about the stand. Yeah, let me tell you, you about this that, and the other. You just weren't. You were very critical of yeah. comics too. 
Yeah, like you, you was all right. Okay, you, critical, you would say you was all right, but this what you didn't do. Why are you cussing? Okay, but that you? came from everyone else. We were all critical of every each other. No, we clowned. We, no, yeah, but we were all. I mean, everybody that I dealt with gave me instruction, and I thought that I was just returning that instruction. Nope. And maybe I didn't present it well. Hey, well it, was certain, it was certain comics that you would listen to, and certain comics you'd be like, really? Yeah. Okay, like that was a flashback, like with the young lady that came. That, that's that the was the old me. That was the Lewis Dixon. I'm like, hey, you can't sit there. And I yeah. should have said, excuse me, how you doing? I probably should have said, hey, excuse me, how you doing? I'm Lewis. This is, this is our man show. If you could please just hold off until we find yeah. out if Jeff's coming, then we'll seat you on the this show. This is the new Lewis. Right. That's what I should have said. After divorce. That's what I should have no, said. No, that's the Lewis he strives to be. Yeah. As opposed to someone who knows that I'm that way would have helped me. <laughs> Not be rude. Would have helped me. Knowing who I am, mm. you would think he would have said, hold up, let me stay it. Let me talk. Lewis, don't be, don't do this. Don't do Lewis. Don't be, don't hey, be hey man, this is my friend. Mm. If he had said that, this is my friend. Yeah. Well, he knows you, you know, once you show who you are, that's who you are. I, I'm going to tell you when I think everybody became more cool. When you go, going through your divorce thing, the the Lewis you was fell off. Mm. And, Chris and, Spencer says I once I met Cosby I, I fell off. I, 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 I became too <laughs> right, nice. Let me no, get through my report, please. Sorry about that. I think you became more. Arrogant. Um, congratulations to Ashante and oh, Nelly. Baby. Oh, baby on the way. Have a she has well they have a baby on the way. She's forty three years old. You mean this the band aid Nelly? Yeah. Yeah. He he was at the uh, Mark Twain Prize. Nice guy. I took a picture yeah. with him. I always thought Nelly was a nice guy. Yeah, he's still a baseball player. Could have yeah. went to the could have went. Mm -hmm. So they've been on and been off. Um yeah, because they got back together, right? Yeah, over yeah. 10 years. That's what on and off means. Some of you would know if some of you should be clear about that. <laughs> so they are together. They, uh, Ashanti. Um, Does she have kids already? Like no, this is mm -hmm. her first baby. And Nelly? Nelly has two eggs. biological kids, yeah. oh. and he adopted it's his sister's yeah. kids who passed away. Oh, good away. for him. Yeah, yeah. so... Making the man's with So him. congratulations yeah, to man. them, too. Look, man, look uh, all right. Trying to get you a one more no, so, no, first of all, I'm sorry, to uh -huh. stuff, first of all, if nothing else, I believe he knows I, I care for him. Absolutely. And you know I care for you. We're working on you. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm I feel you where you at now. Because if you want to punch him, I'm up totally huh. with that. Oh, really? That's what we're doing? <laughs> Okay. You just got to just let things play out, you know. Yeah, I, I'm, yeah. I'm a big proponent of that, so I'm not a big who proponent. <laughs> Go ahead, a big pony. <laughs> you want to ride a pony? I have to say that he's been he's been better and happier since you've been here. Oh, I, I feel like he hasn't felt that. It I was got enough. some help. Yes, it was not enough talent here. <laughs> I, I believe, and it's just me. Speaking. Well, nobody asked you. you <laughs> right here. Let's go with it. Just yeah. If I'm on a show with Tina, it's over. We, we, cause he get me. And I think you guys kind of get me. I was gay. <laughs> yeah, I was real gay. Go ahead, Buck. I don't even know how to get out of that. Before. I feel like Danny right now. Ooh. Paul! Go hey, ahead. Pickle. Go ahead, boss lady. <laughs> okay, so, so not so lucky in the love department is the Golden Bachelor. Yeah. Has filed for divorce oh, already. Oh, come on. After three months. You didn't know it was a Was setup? it really three months? It was... Well, and then, in January. So I, th what I think is that? he said, and they both said now? that their family, because they they live so far. Yeah, apart, they couldn't decide where to live. Where to live. Yeah. He, oh, she shit. wanted to work, and he was ready to go out and see the world, and you know, because he was retired, and How she much you was think still you working. And checks okay. stopped coming in. How much well, you think he you lived on a he had a he was living in a lake house. Oh, um, hmm. Wherever he was living, I, I don't know a city, but she did not want to live there. And mm. I think she lives in That's Jersey, one, and he lives in like Bad dick. Indiana or somewhere. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh well, well, I mean that was should have picked that other girl, the one he made cry. Wow, you actually watched that? No, nah, I did. Yeah. I watched it. She I it. A lot. <laughs> you been? Look, look. I mean, <laughs> she gets I mean, She's, she's been looking like for love that. since she got thrown oh. off the canoe. Oh, <laughs> oh. oh. P money, you need love. Oh. You need some dick in your life. P money needs some dick. Get you some dick now. Get you some dick, dick. Get your dick, dick, dick in your life. You need some dick in your life. A dick in your life. You roll, need roll, it. roll Boy. your dick gently down the stream. Don't let it get away. <laughs> uh. P 
me. When the last time? How long you been holding on to that, Louis? How long you been holding on to that? I was waiting for the right moment, man. Hold up, Portis. We 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 exfoliate around here all the time. You do what? Exfoliate. Who? We put foil on it. That's what we do. <laughs> Stupid motherfucker. We aluminum foliate. You do skincare. Oh yeah. my God. Pause. When the last? None of when your last business. Time? Ain't nobody listen to the show. Tell. It's ten people in that motherfucker. Yeah. yeah. Who it tickled your tune? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, who'd you next say terrible? Who'd you smoke with? Yeah, just, Whoever you smoke just, with, you that just died. Yeah, it just, they were rolling. Yeah, why'd you have to? You just couldn't let it just breathe. Excuse me, she's gargling my balls. Okay. <laughs> You're up. <laughs> See, I came too quick. See? Oh my god, that's the OG right there, Connie Bong. <laughs> yeah, remember that? Okay, so. I watched the Good Times cartoon. I, so, I at least watched all the way, is it how many, episode how many, one episode so four, far. Four. I thought it was hilarious. Uh, I yeah, thought you it was said funny. that on... Um, I, I was saying that about the trailer, but I actually watched episode one. So you liked it? I thought it was okay. Okay, cool. Like you're going to watch them all? or you just Yeah, cool? I'm going to watch them all. Okay. I don't like how high your voice went. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Did you watch it? No. no. Oh, what? see. I know I'm not going to okay. like it. I'm still watching The Dynasty. That with Tom Brady, New England Patriots. Anybody oh. in the chat room, uh, yeah, watch the that? Good Times cartoon. Call in. The number <laughs> is on the screen. <laughs> hmm? But yeah, there's a cool new spot. series coming out <laughs> called Love During Lockup. Mm. Mm. And here's the trailer. Oh, they had this. It's a fat person. Fat girl. I'm serving at like 18 years old, but now I have something more to live for. I love you. I love you too. A blast from the past. Once I heard his voice, just game over. <laughs> now I'm looking at the prison right now. I couldn't believe that I found someone so pure. Four weeks, one day, seven hours, the true is home. I don't think I ever dated somebody that didn't want to go to jail. I'm about to act crazy. Mm -mm. <laughs> My tight got an inmate number coming mm -mm. over. Not in the bathroom. See you. Hello, Orny. Two dudes? <laughs> I will not do this again. Yeah, no. Will. This is Hello. I spent over $30,000 on True, but I've never seen them in person. She was chasing me in second grade. I knew we were going to be an item. I had an agenda. Being in love is worth being broke. Should I get another credit card? No. Stop doing dumb <laughs> I never knew that could happen. Lady, what you got on? It's not shit. I approve it. He's just one of those people who have eyes and ears everywhere. I really feel like you don't know what you're getting yourself into. I have a secret that I'm hiding from my family. That hurts my heart. He'll always be that person for me. I'm going to delete the cameras. This is going to piss him off. Do you want to marry Samantha? Yes. I'm cool. Yeah. I mean, it goes to Jeff's point saying there's always, there's, what somebody is it? Somebody for everybody. Somebody for somebody. That's just ridiculous. Mm hmm no, you can't say that. It's okay. That they found love in jail? No, one, I didn't play the whole trailer, but there was one woman on there that only preferred to date men that were in prison. They know, cause it's, it's a security blanket. They know where he is. Yeah. He in jail, and you, and she knows that person needs her. Some people just need to be known that, that you need And you them. think she's messing with someone else during that no, time? No, no. She's loyal to him? Yeah, because she knows, yeah, that's, that's her getting now. Yeah. That's what now. If it's a dude, the shoes on the other foot. No, a dude's all fuck it. She's the queen of that whole castle, yeah, that she's whole movement. Yeah. yeah, women yeah. like that. That kind of control. And then as soon as you get out, she gonna find something wrong, and then they are gonna break up, and yeah. then she'll pen pal another person, unless he go back to jail. Unless yeah. he go back to jail, it's right back in the wow. program. People are saying this is not new. I know, but there's a new season on <clears throat> the Wee Channel. They like correcting that. You. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the <laughs> debuts. <laughs> Tomorrow. Bitch, you ain't got cable. <laughs> yeah, nigga. Get offline, nigga. <laughs> yeah, you people in the chat room, thank you so much. You people. Yeah, that's racist. Wow. Hey, man, look, these people in the chat room, y'all y'all talk a lot of trash. Code 3 tells you? me that y'all, you all go hard. Well, let's ask Danny. He's and they, him. Code 3 told me they said something about you saying, I think your nose is ignorant. Yeah, <laughs> that was a story. Yeah, that was classic. Like, yeah, that was, that was. I concur. That was un <laughs> unnecessary. <laughs> Don't let it necessarily occur. Oh, oh, that's the poetess report. Okay, oh, great report. Playoffs. Wait, wait before you do. Okay, go, go ahead, do the playoffs. 
practice. We sitting here, I supposed to be the franchise player, and we in here talking about practice. practice. I wish one of your guys had children for I could kick them in the fucking head and stomp on their testicles for you to feel my pain, because that's the pain I have. I wish I was 50 years younger and I'd kick your ass. You won't do shit with you won't do shit. Oh, we look like the damn bad news bears. T the sports ticker. Let's get right into it, huh? <laughs> WNBA draft took place on Monday. Good draft. And the expected uh, Clark from Iowa, the Sun Dodger, went overall number one yeah. to the Indiana yeah. Fever. Her endorsement deals in college was worth more than $3 million. However, her NBA salary it will start horrible. at 76535 <laughs> well, well, in and Indiana, will earn roughly – 338000 for her four-year contract. She's closing a $10 million-plus endorsement deal with Nike, with Nike. including wow. the signature shoe. Yep. Angel Reese was drafted number seven overall to the Chicago Sky. It will earn 324 over the next four seasons. At LSU, she had a NIL deal, which was... Um, estimated at one point eight million. Dang. That ranks her number one school. among women basketball players. <laughs> go back to school. <laughs> However, she'll be able to keep making money in endorsement deals with Reebok, Goldman Sachs, and others. Reese will join former South Carolina center Camila uh, Cardoza, whom the Sky selected Skip number three drive. overall from Jackson State. She's Angel 6'6". Six, six. Angel six, six. Jackson was selected 36 overall by the Las Vegas Aces in the third round of the draft. 6'6", six, six, from Richmond, California. Shout, Shout out, out to Johnny Mack and yeah. Feathers! And uh, Brian Shaw from Richmond, California. Can we get Johnny Mack on the show? Let's try that. <laughs> Speedy. Yeah, let's try that. I, I'll hit him. Mm. He ain't doing shit. Oh, wow. Hut oh, <laughs> 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 two. Uh, NBA playoffs. Remaining two games game yesterday. will be tomorrow night. The Bulls versus the Heat match will see a few significant players out. Alex Caruso, ex Laker, suffered an um, injury. Um, During the game? I watched the game. Well, he'll be out. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. Ankle sprain. Oh, okay. and, oh yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I remember. Yeah. 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 Jimmy Butler offered several weeks due to the uh, MCL injury yeah. on his knee. And the winner will uh, face in the first round the Boston Celtics. That's it. Zion Williams has been ruled out. out. Yeah. yeah. He had a great game Sunday. Yeah. The Lakers. I think they would have beat the Lakers had he yeah, four, stayed yeah. in at three yeah. minutes. Mm-hmm. Good game, though. Very good game. And then we finished them off, so now the Lakers are the uh, seven. <laughs> Going up against Denver. Yeah. Yeah. He's such a Laker fan. Who? Tita. Tita. And we finished them off. Finished them off. <laughs> we got the seven C. There you go. But now we got to worry about them Denver Nuggets. Oh my. Denver matchup. This it's a matchup Goodness. all the way around with Denver, and you're playing it at altitude. So that's the thing. Altitude. Hopefully they go there early. You need to probably get there two days before. No, you get lit there. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. <laughs> I've experienced that, man. man. No, so real. I'm doing a. Um, sorry to do you. Baby. No, go ahead. Sir. I'm doing a. a um, Ski thing, Black Ski Weekend, mm-hmm. and I get one of the comedians, and she smoked weed. And I told her, "Hey, you, you guys, don't smoke no weed to get up here because it's gonna fuck your shit up." She's like, "No, I'm good, I'm good, all right." Got in the room, started smoking weed, and we had to call the paramedics. <laughs> they had to take her all the way to. So she, we were in Aspen, so she had to go back, all the way back to Colorado. And she's like, "Well, can I get paid?" No, bitch, I told you, don't yeah. smoke no weed while you're up here. And she almost died. Mm-hmm. Bitch, almost died in that because that altitude ain't no joke. Hmm? Yeah. Can we get the name? Yeah, Daphne nah. Springs. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm, just I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Cut two. Yeah, yeah, Olympic yeah. countdown, 99 days until Paris. Mm. I like, Yesterday's I like, USA basketball like that announced lineup. the 2024 men's roster, which selected by the national team managing director. You know who that is? No. Grant Hill. Grant, Grant Hill. Hill. Oh, good choice. I got a pair of his sneakers. When he first came to the league, horrible. the feelings. Yeah, they were horrible. And he, he signed. Never helped you. It never made it, so I was like, but I got him. <laughs> That's good team. You, like the, you like the lineup, Tita? I'm about to give it to you. Go ahead, though. <laughs> and the um, so second. USA will take 12 NBA All-Stars, four NBA MVPs, and six NBA champions to Paris. The team won gold in the men's basketball Summer Olympics in 08. 
And then they lost, and LeBron was like, no, nah, we can't have it no more. We got to. I got to get back in there and get them back on track. So we will have July 28th. Uh, no, I'm sorry, July 6th. They will open up in Vegas playing Serbia. Mm. The roster will be Bam Adebayo nice from pickup. Miami. Devin Booker, Phoenix. Mm-hmm. Stephen Curry, Sorry. Golden State. Yes. Mm-hmm. Anthony Davis, Lakers, of course. You know, Kevin Durant, Durant Phoenix. Mm-hmm. Anthony Edwards, Minnesota. Joel Embiid, Philadelphia. Mm-hmm. Tyrese Halliburton, Indy. Um, Drew Holiday, Boston. LeBron James, Blue Lakers. Team. Kawhi Leonard, Clippers. And Jason Tatum from the oh, Boston that's Celtics. A squad. That's a squad. Still need one more big, I think. Because mm. cause most of the, the European teams have bigger people in the paint and they can shoot threes. And yeah, it, I think it's gonna be good. I think I think they can win, but they just play defense and yeah, and run. That's it. That's it. That's all but, I need. But uh, America's gonna shoot them out, shoot the lights out. Steph Curry, they got shooters. Uh, they got a squad. They got shooters all around. Cut three. Toronto Raptors. Oh, Jonte yeah. <laughs> Porter has mm. been given yeah. a lifetime ban from the NBA. It's a wrap. After violating gambling rules, a league investigator revealed that Porter disclosed confidential information that the game influenced the outcome of one of more mm-hmm. bets. He would bet that he would not make so many shots. I'm not finished. An eighty thousand <laughs> online eighty thousand dollar online bet that would un- Dannon. Eighty thousand dollar <laughs> online bet to underperform is what yeah. speedy. Is alluding to. It would be easy to do, nigga. Just don't shoot. <laughs> Should in a March 20 game, which would have had paid out 1.1 million, and the large amount led to the wager being frozen and not paid out. The NBA said Porter placed at least 13 bets on the NBA game using someone else's betting account. These bets range from $15 to 22,000 mm-hmm. for a total of 54,000. For the payout and uh, seventy six thousand resulting in winnings of he received twenty one thousand mm-hmm. a little over not no real money. Thousand, and he Porter just, is the brother of Denver Nuggets, Michael Porter Jr. Oh, that's his brother. I yeah, know that. he spent much time in the pros in the G League. That's he played twenty six games for Toronto, averaged four points. Then Memphis, twenty twenty one, averaged two points. He's from the University of Missouri. And so, yeah, lifetime ban like a Pete Rose. Other players have been banned from the sport as well. But if, if gambling is legal. But uh, yeah, I think you can't bet on your yeah, team. You can't, can't bet, bet on, on your team. You can't bet on your team. You can bet on other teams. You can't bet on your, you can't, you really can't bet on what how many shots you're going to make. You can't do that. Yeah, what I'm saying is if you use somebody else's account to make a bet, but somebody snitched on you. Oh, yeah, you know, definitely you not. Know. That's how that went down. Um, and also in the NBA news, uh, a retirement, Blake Griffin. Yeah. Hanging him Officially up. Officially uh, because he didn't play none this year. 14 years. Damn. He Came is. in hard, though. Sure yeah. Oklahoma. Came in hard. Same thing she said. <laughs> <laughs> but he Not this guy. <laughs> <laughs> but he did have a cheat code because he was hurt his rookie season and came oh, back. Yeah. Second yeah. season, then got rookie of the year, which people thought was foul. Right, that he got a chance to you know be in Raleigh Brasilies and see and learn, get a whole year to get rookie out of the love. But yeah, he was he was excitement when he was with the Clippers. Yeah, they, they should have got a ring that, that when they got yeah. beat by I think it was Houston. Yeah, it yeah. was up three one. That, that was the one they should have got. They should have definitely went to the finals. They was up three one. Yeah, Vinny had them balling. Yeah, and that's Teeter Sports ticker. All right, Teeter. I I have to say, um, were you grading this nigga? Yeah, okay. and I think his t- his sports t- t- just going. Okay. I mean, I see his notes and he's doing his homework and he's. I I have, I'm impressed because the beginning you've never seen the first one. Oh. Oh. He's winging it. Oh, he was, he was wasn't even in the wing. It was getting shot rude. down. Pull, <laughs> pop. No. They go to but, rudeness. What? <laughs> the rudeness. <laughs> the rudeness. The rudeness. That's just. I mean, no. I mean. The honest rudeness. Yeah. Your voice goes so high. Yeah, exactly. You all see that's what kills me. You all tell me when I'm shortchanging it and not good enough. Well, because well, we always wanted to do it back in the day. Now we can't because you old. Well, I always <laughs> did it back in the day. So I don't know why y'all was scared of that motherfucker. He's from Philly. I thought he could fight. No. <laughs> wow. Well, I found wow yeah. Way to give up on yourself. <laughs> Real fast. Um, he threw the towel in. Yeah. Uh, so uh, I'm Lewis Dix. 
CDP. Jeff Arnold. Speed Doggy Dog. What's the name of the show? In a Man's World. Tighten up your belt. Uh, we appreciate you listening. Uh, now, um, she's your queen to be. Hey. hey. A queen to be forever. Mm -hmm. A queen who'll do whatever is high. Oh, okay. Wow. Hey. Hey. Wow. I like her natural look. She's got nice behind. Thigh. Oh my God! Um, that is um, um, Deborah F uh, Fewell. <laughs> F e w e l. Use that broken one. Yeah, Fewell. It's from Washington D.C. Shout out to her. She enjoys dancing, singing, and acting. That's what Deborah. Else? Uh, my God, she is. Which her is teeth. Deborah, but they pronounce it. Uh, uh, no, it's Deborah. Yeah, Deborah. Oh, is it Deborah? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. What'd you say? I said Deborah. Yeah, I said Deborah. Yeah, but he said Deborah. She probably would correct you. He's more said. educated. He went to Crenshaw. Deborah, if you will. Yeah. So, I, I mean, I, I just, I'm in the teeth now. Well, I've always been in the teeth. Mm -hmm. But I, I've recently got my SAG back so I can go get to my dentist. Oh, wow. Your SAG? SAG after health insurance. Oh, I thought you were trying to mm. say swag. No, my SAG. Because <laughs> I was, I, I had, had, my LA, swag back. I yeah. had LA Care. Oh, okay. Yeah. And LA Care is, is they think they everybody's. They don't care about you. They don't care about you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. they, they think everyone's from a third world country when you oh, say LA Care. Yeah. Because they want you to get all the blood work, everything done. Mm -hmm. Do you have, you know, have you been out of the country and all that, all those unnecessary questions. Yeah. And, and nothing against the doctors. They're good doctors. Mm -hmm. they're, they're thorough. Mm -hmm. But, L, you know, SAG and after is just much better. So I can get my eyes checked, my ears checked. Why? Well, um, and I had my teeth done and I had I them clean. And I had them a little, I'm mm -hmm. trying to get the white teeth that everyone has. Veneers? No, but I had my teeth whitened a little bit. Mm -hmm. And uh, so well, I feel. Well, it's hard to do. You kind of dark. I can't tell. <laughs> oh, oh, P money. So I found out I need. It a was fill. by the rim though. It was I right found there. Out I need you a beat fill. me to it. <laughs> <laughs> Gold tender. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Code three is always happy when I get things like that done because she's like, "You handling your business." She likes that. Oh. So now that you got all your that back, what are you gonna do bad. about the nose? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and I, I told Co3, uh, she's been pushing me to go on a cruise. Mm. So I'm going to Hopefully go. She'll push my you mom off. said yeah. go, and my sister that's said go. That's exactly why. why? Let's go, let's go to the edge. Back. Yeah. <laughs> no, she said At night. No, she's yeah. going, we, I'm going to grab the rail. I'm going to weekend yeah. first. What are you scared of? I don't, I don't do boats. I, don't, I love cruises, you know? but I've been watching this series called Killer Cruises, and every episode is about. Somebody getting pushed off. And then and he told me to get look killed over there. on a cruise. I'm not going to the edge, but she really likes it. Her sisters go and her friends go. They're so nice. I'm, I'm going to go. Her oh, sister don't like you. I, exactly. Her sister don't like they you. No, her sister you. doesn't like me. But <laughs> is she like going? Is the sister going? No, we're definitely okay. not going. No, definitely not. Why does she like you? Huh? What? Look at him. Okay. <laughs> You're a Look at him. Okay. Here's the, <laughs> Listen to him. Here's the deal why her sister, one of her sisters doesn't like me. And I'm sure that's why the other one doesn't like me. So when Code 3 and I first met, mm -hmm. Okay, this is what happened. And I, I don't... I, her... Get to the her, trauma. <laughs> her Tell nephew you was going through some issues, and he was going to use my place because he wanted to go to Fairfax. Hi. Oh. Uh, your address. Right. So Got he wanted it. to use my address. Mm -hmm. So I had to take up um, uh, a bill. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The, and you show it, a bill. the bill happened to be in red because I would never pay my bills until they sent the red. Oh, wow. That makes sense. And her sister saw it. And the sister thought that Code 3 was paying for it. But no, I was just giving her the yeah. bill. And she's like, he don't handle his business. So after that, she thought I was trifling. Mm -hmm. She still do. Well, she do. Yeah, she had a point. Huh? Yeah. yeah. And I was like, it hurt my feelings, you oh, know. Wow. You didn't have one that didn't have no red on it? No, I didn't. You can find <laughs> one? So, so he wasn't able to go to school because your, your bills Man, weren't no, paid? They, they, they send you, they, 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 they send the first bill. Like yeah. Yeah, yeah Louis look at that go, eh, they ain't right. serious yet. <laughs> They're not that serious. They're not that serious. Yeah. Right. No, I, 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 that was where I, now I pay it on time. Yeah. I don't, it doesn't get to the red. But, uh, so that was, but, but. She, they, but Code Three's in my corner. She's all about me. I give it to her. She, she tells, forget them. You, it's Stay you and I. Stay in my corner. So I'm gonna go on that boat. I'm gonna go on. If I get that call, I'll be like, really? What? It's like I don't know what happened. Oh, he's Lewis fell. <laughs> <laughs> we can't find him. He got drunk. He got drunk. No. So okay. So um, it is um, now time for one of our favorite segments. People, I guess, like your segment already. Oh, uh, Club Fluffy. That's what I heard. I, I, I heard Let's go. That, um, Poetess. Uh, my mouse is 
Oh, wow. Mm. Oh, my God. <laughs> rub it, honey. Rub Next it. Week, we're going to bring Make some, it grow. some spray for these little bugs. No, I it's, know it's, got the door it's open. A, it's, it's a scent. Season. It's a candle you can get to get rid of these. Okay. Well, here we go. You just know everything. I do. I'm, I'm, sure I'm, you got I'm a Virgo. That's how it goes. Oh, are you? Yeah. When's your birthday? September 21st. Oh, my, oh, wow. my mom's okay. September 5th. Yeah, really was. Welcome to Club Fluffies. So fine. It's your boy Speedy. I'm the so proprietor. Fine. Howard Johnson. <laughs> yes. Your musical entertainment. And that Buffets are that on room. sale. Oh, yes. Whoa. Yes, yes, yes. Beautiful Ooh. ladies and all the big girls in the house at the bar. Mm. Our bartender this evening is TDP. What you got for the ladies? Hey, Peter? we got Vienna sausages and vodka. <laughs> $2. That's the all salmon night. girl. That's too much salmon. <laughs> That's a lot of salmon right there. Oh my god! And you and you working the court, the court, uh, the what? Coats, the coat check, the coat check. You'll say two hangers per person. <laughs> <laughs> two hangers per person. Oh, oh this is gonna take a wooden. <laughs> <laughs> and Jeff Brown, uh, Jeff Arnold. Wow, is, uh, security. Wow, well, I get it, Jeff. How's security? Is it the line outside? Yeah. It's around the corner. Oh, and there's only two three people. <laughs> exactly. We took a pass. But play, show the ladies again. They look fabulous. I'm okay, it's, okay, hold on, hold on. <laughs> no, look. Can you pause it when you, sh- you play it? Oh, she did yeah, it too I fast. Okay, so. yeah. all right. In other words, don't be Jeff. You went too fast. Free <laughs> <laughs> <Hey>, calm. <laughs> pump, pump one. <laughs> What do you do after that? You get dressed? I'm out. Yeah. That was it, man. Oh, you got things. You can just show the pictures. Oh, your pictures. I'm sorry. I know. I like I like that. All right. Pause it. If you can pause it. Okay. She's beautiful. Now, Tell the truth. she is a pretty girl. Mm-hmm. Now, what part of her turns you on? Everything. What do you mean, what part? All like, when she takes that off, the stomach falls. It doesn't bother. So what? He likes hearing her stomach growl. <laughs> <laughs> Does not bother me. You're shallow. It's more to handle. Very yeah. shallow. Huh? More to handle. It's more to yeah. handle. Yeah. You never had a big girl? Not that big. Now that is too much. No, that's not too now much. Now come on. Come on. No, you can't where you can't even find that. Hmm. Uh, where do you, where's the spot? You have to sprinkle powder on it. Oh. <laughs> oh wow. Go to Joe. Now how did she get in those jeans? She put them on. She put them on. <laughs> okay, all right. Now, what's the next girl? She's gorgeous. That's the same one for no, that's not different. She's one. sassy. You don't like it? No, she's sassy. I like her. I mean, they all have cute faces. No. no but once you get below the waist, it's like, oh. oh wow. You mean below the neck? No, below Cute the faces in wrecked places? <laughs> yeah, she killing it. No. What do you know about that, too? Look at her fourth thigh. <laughs> <laughs> Why she got the fanny pack in her skirt? <laughs> That's nasty. I love that. I love it. That's nasty. I love it. That's nasty. What is the picture saying? I done bust all over that. Oh, Oh my God. Now, that Uh, that is unnecessary. Paul! Look at her navel. It's (laughs) navel. If you love my segment, hit me on Speedy is Funny and say, Speedy, keep going. Send me some pictures. Matter of fact, Speedy is Funny. Send me some pictures. Yeah, a couple of guys. So here's Speedy's choices of the week. Yes. Oh, my God. Now, these ladies sent this. She's absolutely beautiful. Yeah, she's cute. She's cute, mm-hmm. but her her left breast looks bigger than the right one. Who cares? That's Lewis? nature. You're being pick, picky. Okay, yeah. And she is. Uh, oh, uh, yeah. She's all. That. Where's her bottom part hey, of her hey, baby? Hey, it's okay. tucked away. <laughs> <laughs> That's coming off. Is that ice work. cream by her? It's what is that? Tucked away. <laughs> okay. She's a beautiful woman. No. She's ready to go out. Nah, she looks no, like okay. she just got back from church and forgot what she was supposed to wear. <laughs> <laughs> like she milked cows. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah, the purse is the cutest thing on her. Uh, uh, Jamaican man. Yeah. Now, these ladies sent no these chocolate. pictures to you. No, no, no. I, I, have, I have a site that I have. No oh. kidding. Oh, <laughs> That's a site. But, yeah. but, but if you're the listening to fan, the show, huh? fellas, or young ladies, and you want me to showcase, highlight. showcase you, highlight you. Yeah. Hit me a speedy is funny on everything. A speedy I Z Objection. funny on everything. Them girls so big, you could do two segments. But that's cool. They do a different one. Well, and yeah, silence fell, fell over the, the land. land. <laughs> that went nowhere. Huh? That went nowhere. And he gets you on that. He did. He would have went. Didn't. Yeah. It didn't. That's why he started doodling. Like, <laughs> <laughs> that didn't hit. <laughs> he started doodling as soon as he said it. He'd have been like, see, that was right. unnecessary right there. That okay. Was okay. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, thank you. Lo- that's comedy 101. Yeah. yeah see. <laughs>
<laughs> you see, just when you think you're going, you do too much. You do too much. Yeah. All right, so listen. No, quit faking yeah, what like did you, you write? Your pen, your huh? You went to the pen thing. What did you yeah. write? Oh, I wrote... Uh, Bombing. <laughs> <laughs> Again. Hiroshima. <laughs> Hiroshima. <laughs> Nuclear. <laughs> All right, I had a question. I had a question. Okinawa. Yeah. I wrote down, go to my question. Because <laughs> uh, Dan, Why did top, I say that? Dan is not here, so I, I crossed him out and I said, go to my topic. Mm. And my one of my topics that I wanted to talk about was the fact that what do you do... If I, I I saw a guy in the supermarket today that I, I knew, please don't touch me again. Uh, old old yeah. dude, and the girl behind him was his daughter. Okay, and I was like, oh, it's your daughter. Yeah, she's thirteen, and she was not a good looking girl. Well, uh, she's thirteen. She got time to grow up. And I start thinking, like, what do you wow. do? What do you do if if you know your daughter is not good looking? What you know, you? and 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 she can't find a man, and and, and you know, like, but you know she's. That's she's gonna live with you for a long time. That's I mean, weird. you know, how do you handle that? You know, like my daughter was was cute, but then she Which had. Which one? Oh, <laughs> oh man! <laughs> There's a cripple in the sky for our love. <laughs> we send this one back on to keys. <laughs> this one ain't gonna work out. Send that one back. Oh, oh, man, come on. Baby Sydney, I love you. Come on. Okay. All right. 12 day cute. Uh, 17 days. Come on. She lived for 17 well, she days. Well, she started deteriorating after. <laughs> so she ain't going to wake up. That's what y'all say. <laughs> there was hope for 12 days. After 12 days. You know, I have I those videos. She'll you make good fertilizer. Uh, <laughs> oh, God. Bring me those bag of barrettes. Never mind. <laughs> Hey, bust them pink balloons. So. Hey, put that stroller together. Never mind. <laughs> she, no, we, uh, you'll never have kids. Uh, put that mobile over the crib. Never mind. That, come on. All right. So, oh. so, uh, so I was just wondering because you have daughters. Yes, I do. And now, if you, if you, you know your daughter, funny looking. Like when my kids were born, they were funny. Looking. I didn't no, take, I'm I didn't take about the when picture, they get older and they start. They're like third. They're like twenty five. <laughs> my, my kids are cute. Yeah, 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 okay, your kids are cute. But I'm just saying, so there, 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 there are a lot of guys' daughters who are not cute. Let's just be honest. Well, we know that. Well, they're not even here. So, <laughs> yeah, but what do you do? do Nothing. You, what did, What can you do? I mean, how do you encourage them? She's live with you a long time. How would you, you encourage them? How? They could have inner beauty. Well, <laughs> that ain't gonna get him far. She not, she I need a, some X-rays yes, then. Will. Like, all right, so so she's not a clean. I need some X-rays. So prom, she can cook. You gotta learn how to cook. So prom is here. She doesn't have anybody that wants to take her to the prom. She's not ready yet. Yeah. So uh, full disclosure, my my dad wanted me to take my sister to the prom. I said, she. <laughs> I got an image. Boy. He's wild. Get you whooping. You might as well get your belt, motherfucker. She's not going to the prom this year. So my sister didn't go to her prom. Because you didn't take her? No. Hmm. Nigga, I'm a speed. Because she was your sister or because she was not going? <laughs> Both. <laughs> wow. Really, Portis? Portis off. getting in there today. I know it's by the rim, but shit. Yeah. I can dunk, too. <laughs> she was laughing before she even got the shit out. Caitlin Clark. <laughs> so what, was, she, was she not a good-looking girl? Wow. She was my sister. I, I just mm, okay. can't take my sister to the prom. Oh, just no, be. no, you didn't answer the question. She wasn't. I, my sister look okay. She married. She found somebody like. <laughs> uh, he's <laughs> blind. <laughs> like my 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 huh? my mom. What Johnny my, Gill got to do my, with this? My 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 Malcolm. I love my mom. She's not a looker. Wow. Mm. And my God, sister. Damn, wow. My, my sister. Can we say it? It would have been funnier. <laughs> Shit. I mean, with all due respect, I love her, but she's just a nice person. She's just, you know, my she's dad. She's still with us, right? But my dad, yeah, she's still with us. But my dad was the first person to tell me that you should always have an ugly woman. Oh, wow. wow. And I was like, yeah, you got one. <laughs> but, <laughs> Damn. <laughs> but no, my mom was good, though. She could make potato salad. Hilarious. Oh, wow. <laughs> hey, Joe Frazier. <laughs> so, so your mama was a hard sales. Oh, my God. I mean, I mean, just, yeah. I, mean, she, woo. I mean, but she had a nice smile. I mean, wow. you know. Wow. So who you look like? 
Like your mom. My mixture of my dad. I got my mom's eyes. She had nice eyes. Who well, knows you got? Yeah, I got exactly. My mom's. That's family. a platypus. <laughs> <laughs> now, all right, everybody. Your mom is pretty. Yeah, my mom is gorgeous. Your mom is pretty. Yeah. I'd hit Cabot, your mom. Wow. Platypus. <laughs> Shit. Platypus. You want to wait till we get off air? <laughs> you gonna date her right now? Well, I, I, hit I hit. I hit. And not for a minute either. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. She gonna get it all. <laughs> as soon as I get out this jacuzzi. <laughs> I get this motherfucker to stretch. Now, now, now. Gotta heat it up. Uh, now, was, was your mama good looking? Well, yeah, she had a few guys. So she, wow. Yeah, oh, wow. So she was out there. <laughs> Boy, what was your mom's attribute? This seat is a motherfucker. What, <laughs> what attribute did your mom bring to the table? She had My nice mother was butt. cute. She My was, mom was cute. She was cute? Yeah, she was cute. And she evidently. <laughs> when she had, like, how many kids? She had, we had seven. Seven, seven so hmm? she didn't give head. So <laughs> seven, oh, seven. wow. That's called a litter. Oh, wow. Oh, damn. Lewis. I feel like I got lured into this shit. They didn't have gawk gawk back there. <laughs> Lewis, let's go to your video. Oh, no. We got to stay here. <laughs> Wait a minute. We in trauma right now. <laughs> yeah, oh, ER. Yeah. Shit. Well, you got to get out of that one. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, let's go See, to See, if this was Dannon, it'd oh, be quiet. Yeah. This be Dannon. Well, his mom, did, his mom did, I mean, she didn't tell I me, mean, come on, her, stall, her, her, her womb was dead. <laughs> okay, it's fine. Ah, oh, damn. Here's the video. He didn't Go! Go, speed, speed, speed! This was funny. Oh, I'm actually too scared. You got this. No, no, no. You got this. That was literally perfect. Just keep your speed. You'll oh, go right, right over. Go. Okay. You'll be okay. You got listen it. Listen to that kid. Don't listen to that kid. No, you're not. He He has protection. These kids ain't Ready, shit. Ready, partner? He said partner. Yeah, All right. Full speed. <laughs> Let's go, go, Carter. Pedal. Oh, oh. shit. <laughs> <laughs> Are you good? Carter. <laughs> That mean you hurt cry right there. Everything hurt. <laughs> <laughs> say, oh, shit. It was one guy that said, uh, hey, you guys are going to kill him. <laughs> Have you ever done anything that your buddies got you to do and you it didn't go well? Or you had a buddy that you got yeah, to do? Yeah, my brother did that to me. What? Put me in an old lady shopping cart. Took me up three flights of stairs <laughs> and pushed me down. <laughs> Damn. That's how you got that dent right there. <laughs> you remember that? Yeah. How old were you? Like Seven. And broke my arm, and my uh, my right arm, and my uh, my. Fucked your eye up. You want to add that? No, I was born that way. <laughs> okay. I was okay. born that way. Wow. You went over yeah. that basket. Yeah. Yeah. Are I, you? Uh, somebody put me inside of a uh, air dryer. I climbed it. in, and the motherfuckers turned it on. <laughs> wow. Did you spin around? <laughs> yes, that motherfucker spin around. Because <laughs> back then, the dryer, you just how much you just did hit you it. weigh? Was there a warranty on the dryer? I was scared. Hold it. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's two you got tonight. That's you a heavy know. load. <laughs> right. I don't it was know. a dryer. Watch a dryer could do that. Uh, I was I was like seven or eight, and I climbed in. And the motherfucker slammed the door and hit the button and ran. Who let you out? My mother came down. Wow. So How many times mom. did you go around? She wasn't asleep. Oh. After she was done. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. She was. <laughs> no, you should have said she wasn't asleep. <laughs> it woke her up. <laughs> no, it was an apartment building. Oh, okay. so it was, it yeah. oh. All right, so here's the other video. Oh, wait, 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 wait. wait, wait, wait. Quarters? Wait, wait. No, no, he's here. Have you ever done anything or got somebody? It seems like you would be the kind of guy that would get someone to do something. No, they got me with the um, walking by and, and lit the firecracker and the fresh dog doo doo. <laughs> Bow! <laughs> Fuck your outfit up. <laughs> I was gonna wear this. Won't be wearing this no more. <laughs> I read the comments and uh, some people were like, "Oh, let kids be kids. They're just boys." But some people were like against it. They thought it was that right there. That's yeah. what kids do. No, that's rites of passage. Yeah, there. Yeah. That's your boy. I mean, that kid will never forget. I mean, come on. That's what you do. He Not, stopped pedaling. That was the problem. The well, the, that, he wasn't gonna make that. He, he's evil <laughs> can evil. He wasn't gonna make that. Right. But that's what we did but as that's, boys. That's what kids did. Yeah. They talked you to all kind of go steal something. Play it again and listen to the encouragement. Yeah. And there was one kid yeah. said that you guys are going to kill him. Well, <laughs> but he was the one with the camera. He needed to right, right, right. That said, yeah. speed up. Yeah. And then watch the kid. He didn't. He didn't. He stopped pedaling. 
No, listen to the so kids. So you would tell him to do it again. Come on, you can do it. You can yeah, do it. Yeah, I mean, he's just gotta, go fast. It's the art. It's evil can evil. He has to. He didn't That's get back any... in the day where we used to jump ramps. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah let's see. And the ramp wasn't stable. It was, it was, like, was just soft when he hit. It's like Neo in the Matrix. Right. Nobody so makes the, the next... first jump. We can't play that. Uh, this is the video again. <laughs> Hold on, let me pull it up. That's what she said. Yeah, I like when you pull it up. <laughs> pull it out. <laughs> Except for when it's wet. <laughs> <laughs> it's not shivered up. Okay, listen to the encouragement. This is boy stuff, man stuff. Hey, out in the he woods. Was, and he was going to fall one way or the other, today or tomorrow. Oh, you so can tell when get out the way. Yo! Yo, speak, speak, speak! Oh, I'm actually too scared. See, now that's like, when he should have got off his you bike yeah. and said, fuck y'all. Perfect. Just keep your speed. You'll oh, go right over. Okay. You'll be okay. You got it. Well, he that's was right. He <laughs> right. He went right over. He didn't listen. Yeah. <laughs> My man said, he's got protection. He has protection. <laughs> yeah. That's the camera guy. He's good. Ready, Carter? Come on, Carter. You can do it. Uh, Carter! Full speed! Let's go. Let's go, go. Carter. Pump! Watch, he stopped pedaling. Oh, oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> Are you good? With that cry? That's that a real cry. Funny. <laughs> that is that not funny. funny. That is so funny. How is that not hilarious. funny? That's yeah. how you tell him, shut up, shut up, because you don't want to get in trouble. Yeah, yeah everybody's going to the house. got to walk that bike yeah, back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 My shut brother, up, brother got hit. By a car, and he's dark like you. So when he got hit, oh, wow. he wow. and the whole side of his face was was gone. Yeah, oh, like, it was white. Wow. So as he's walking back, and I said, I was like, "You okay?" He's like, "I'm okay." But when the ambulance came, he started crying, and my dad was like, "What the fuck you crying about?" And which dad? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Let's go to the next segment. Was this it your dad? real dad or your the dad, dad your dad. mama like? Is <laughs> the dad my mama like? Okay. <laughs> was it was it three fingers or two? <laughs> oh my god! Uh, uh, Speedy, I invited you, you into the in a man's world because they made um, Cabot made a meme called the butcher's son. <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> Let me pull it up before we go. Oh, but here's um, a video that um, Lewis sent. And he asked, what would you do? A 19-year-old out to buy his grandfather some socks came across a bag with $135,000 just sitting near Wells Fargo ATM in Albuquerque. Jose Nunez Romanes told CBS affiliate KRQE he called the number on the ATM, then police, because he knew trying to keep the money meant he would have to deal with mom. Back of my head, I was just thinking about my Stupid. parents, especially my yeah. mom. What, what would she would do if I came home with the money? And what she would do with her chancla to hit me. <laughs> it turns out the Wells Fargo subcontractor, whose job it is to fill the ATM, left the cash there by accident. The mayor and police chief recognized Nunez for doing the right thing when no one was looking and invited him to apply as a public safety officer while nah, still in no school. Money. Nunez also got a $500 check yeah, from that. New Mexico energy provider PNN. Five you ain't even got to ask the question. Five hundred dollars they gave him. Uh, off a hundred, what? Hundred thirty, hundred thirty-five thousand dollars. I would have been Untraceable. scared. I would have been scared because there's cameras shit. around there, right? No, apparently it wasn't. I don't care. He called in. Yeah, they didn't say that the money was missing. Yeah. So <laughs> the question would be: Question, would you? What would you? Have done? How how does the Brinks guy just forget a uh, bag of it's money? It's called like edibles. That? Yeah. <laughs> Long hours. Yeah. Now, what would you have happen. done? So, are we referencing what our moms would say? No. No. No, because I'm saying that's a joke. It doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> Don't yeah. you give him here. Give give him the pen. Go and write your shit down. No, I would have kept it. Uh, I would have kept it. Now, would you have just not spent it and just held off? No, I would have just like kept it and just peeled off. Yeah. Would you have told anybody? No. Not even your girl. No. You'd have told her. No, I wouldn't. Trying to impress her. No, I wouldn't. She might turn you in. And no. She keep the money. Push you off the boat? No. Oh, these right. hundreds in my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> so she told no, you got the rent money? Yeah, bitch. Yeah, you got all the rent money. Yeah. <laughs> you? Keeping it. Yeah. Nigga, them days, if I was young, maybe. But nigga, no. Today? Yeah, well, I'd have been right in here. Y'all hungry? Yeah. Let's go eat. <laughs> so me. Yeah, I, I, I couldn't. I wouldn't tell Code 3. Would you but you'd keep it? it? I'd keep it. I'd give it to Lewis. Oh, wow. Scary. All of yeah. No. <laughs> you don't love him like that. <laughs> Not all of it. Not all of it. Did you get baby girl I, song? Oh yes, I get. I spread it around and I keep my. I wouldn't spend it. Can I get keep some? It. You still yeah, be I Lewis. You. you still be Lewis. Yeah, I said, low key. Mm -hmm. Now, would you tell anybody? No. You wouldn't tell us. No. Wouldn't Tina? tell anybody. Not even Jeff. No. Definitely not him. Uh. I'll put it where Sydney's at. 
<laughs> you gotta earn your keep. <laughs> TDP. Slide over, baby. For me, it's always a story. Latina guy, janitorial service downtown, Temple and Broadway. Speedy, the Brinks truck hit the corner. The back door open. A pallet, two hundred and fifty thousand, slide out. He yeah. take the pallet, put it in his lap, take the bus home, and called and told him that he found the money. They gave him two hundred dollars for two hundred and fifty thousand in the pallet. Yeah, I'd have been pulling that pallet Come to on, my house. Man. <laughs> he got on the bus with that and made it home with it. You could have died just holding that. Two hundred and turn that in, like, come on, yeah. two hundred dollars. He can still talk. So you don't believe in God? Who say God is blessing me? What? That's a blessing. It's a blessing. Poetess. I don't know. This whole studio be new. <laughs> what time is the dispensary oh. open? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I got hundreds. Exactly. Um. I just think nowadays there's too many cameras everywhere. No, you got home. It would have been. You're at home. Nobody knows. But still, they can. Trace it back. But that's the mind fuck they got you on. Yeah. You want to watch some cameras. If I feel like if there was no cameras around and I could get away with it. Uh, Let's say you make maybe. it home and it, it, nobody, they only say the same thing about it. You don't hear about it till maybe a couple of days later that the money's missing. I would be a, a nervous wreck for if I kept it. Now, I would be a nervous wreck. That's the wreck. thing, but could it's they just charge money. you? No. No, you just, well. Finders keepers? Well, I mean. Yeah, what, I think if they you can't can be charged for that. What, okay, oh, you can't? What, what yeah. they Even though I didn't, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't steal it. You knew it wasn't well, yours. Yeah, but, you know, <laughs> exactly. well, I, did find I, don't it. Know I don't know where it's at. I just left it. I just threw it in the trash. I didn't, you know, <laughs> Wait, I just Sheena, left it. Then Sheena, I, where are you going, producer? Give me some water. Mm. She grown when, you know she was grown when you met her. She just slammed I hate the door. when people ask me questions. I was going to ask her a question because she asked me a question earlier. So, okay, I'll, I'll get it when she comes. Why are you so mean? She's cool. Dannon thought she was homeless when he oh, first wow. met her. Wow. This Why fool. do you listen to Dannon? Yeah, this fool. She was out there working out. And Dannon came in. It's this that homeless is, woman. That out there. Like, that's thing. our producer. That is a homeless thing to do. Huh? <laughs> to work out. <laughs> in, a, in a parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> get my cardio in. Ah. Get over the sense. All right, I'm Louis Dix. TDP. Jeff Arnold. <laughs> Speed now, doggy dog. Are you gonna do topic number three? No. But I was gonna I was trying to ask you a question, producer, that you had asked earlier. She had, when I came in, she was saying she had a question and I kind of forgot it, so I was gonna ask her to repeat it. Well if you play some jazz. Mm. True. Good point, Speedy. Good point. Now what was the the, the question back. was the question was I had noted that this week the cast members from a different world. Oh yeah. Were at the White circulating, House. you know, at the White House, yeah. and mm -hmm. everyone went around and you know was curious. And I wanted to know how you felt about that, how you felt of being a part of that wedding. Oh yeah, yeah. And how you felt about you didn't get the call. Yeah, he didn't get the call. <laughs> right. So it was. You was, for those you was six season. No, I was. I was there. Um, so the question was that. How many seasons? Uh, I'm talking about on camera. I'm no, not talking about on, warm up. Yeah, warm up. But no, on camera, I, I did actually did two shows, two different characters. But her question was, now that a different world's going on tour and talking about historical black colleges and they were at the White House, how do I feel about it, the legacy and feeling not being included? Because now the first thing I thought when it happened, I was like, wow, I'd like to be the person that would introduce them on these different tours. I gotta get the audience But you were warm up. That. Yeah, but I, was, I had two characters on the show. And my answer to her was that because the actors, there wasn't enough money to spread around to have other people in it. Because I was thinking that these actors, it was over 30 years ago. Mm -hmm. So the residuals have gone down. These actors need money. So I'm, I'm sure they negotiated what they need to negotiate so they can actually. Tour. Yeah, because they all fly in first class. Reboot. So so let right. me let me throw this at you. So I did Jimmy Fox show, and I did a, I played the character all through the fight. Thing. If they did a tour, I don't think they would call me. And say right, speed. me either. Yeah, so I don't yeah, think. No. Yeah, so I, that's what I was saying. I, I didn't. I mean, I know you did the show and you did the warm up right. the whole time. Right. That was just my ego wanting to be a part of it. Yeah. And where you try to figure out where. But then I they have to explain in. you. Who's this guy? Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> that worked out. Here's a warm up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. What's a warm up? It's crazy. Right. Yeah. But it, I mean, it's an iconic show. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, it's uh, it, cause, it's a show that I think everyone watched. It was Thursday nights, I think. Was it yeah, Thursday it was after Thursday, Cosby? Thursday nights. Yeah. yeah after it Cosby. was a great. It was a great show. Yeah. It was a great fantastic show. show. What was your favorite show during that time to watch? Law and Order. Law and Order? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Oh, that was your favorite beginning, show? beginning part yeah. of yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. We watched The Sopranos religiously. The Wire. The Wire. I didn't fire. watch The Wire till later. I would say Miami Vice. Yeah. Miami Vice. Because it was weird because Miami Vice came on Fridays, which is usually a death yep. sentence for shows. Yep. Fridays and Sundays. And but no one would leave until you until you watch Miami Vice and then you would go to the club. Yeah. So, so that when you were older, you watched that. What was mm-hmm. your show? Mm-hmm. Well, mm-hmm. younger, nineties or eighties. Mm-hmm. Mine was the Cosby Show in a Different World. Where you work? And Fresh Prince. So fair. No, I, I love those shows mm-hmm. and The Sopranos. New we York watched Undercover. New York Undercover was a good show. Here's a question: like Do you think shows like that could come back? Yeah. Like a show driven by a, a black lead in Living yeah. Color. Yeah. Oh, let me call it. Yeah. So, which I didn't know, but I knew about the halftime. That the halftime, you know, they never had Super Bowl, right? Real halftime show. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But when they got the numbers for that men on film, motherfuckers said, uh, "We ain't letting them motherfuckers get away with that shit no more." And the next season, they made sure they bought on uh, a musical act. To, mm. uh, now, now, what was your show? You said what? You didn't like New York Undercover? No. Nah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So yeah, what show was hot that you did not feel? You didn't like? That everyone else loved. 21 Jump Street. Yeah. You didn't feel that one? No. I like the music. It was M. Tume was the music guy on oh, there. Oh, he was. That's right, yeah. But the, um, like when the shows first came out, because you know, we were outside, so we knew they are going to rerun in the summertime. Mm-hmm. So that's when you would catch mm-hmm. them like that, because everybody's going to be talking about what they've seen. So you'll, you'll hear about the shows, but you'll see them later in the summer when they rerun them. So I didn't get into Married with Children. I, that was a funny was show. Funny. Was very funny. funny. Yeah, I did warm up. Oh, yeah, that's right. You said that. Yeah, I didn't. I mean, I didn't like the Cosby Mysteries. The uh, Dougie Doug. Yeah, that was, that was the tough. Cosby Mysteries. Yeah. That wasn't with Dougie Doug. That was with um, Most Def. Dougie Doug was on the. No, Doug it was Doug Most Def. Okay. Co- Dougie Doug was on the second boot of the Cosby show. show. Okay. But but Most Def is an underrated actor. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh really? <laughs> oh oh yeah. Oh my god. Oh he's. What was the movie with him and um? Oh, that's why he was in Brown uh, Sugar. Uh, uh, mm, Italian no, Job with um, Bruce Willis. I don't know, but he was in that one movie where he played the the doctor. He was the baker. Uh, Yeah. No, Italian job. He did great. He killed it. Oh, yeah. 16th. um, 16th? Yeah, 16th. Yeah. 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 16 blocks. Yeah. So did he answer your question? 16 blocks. Good movie. Yeah, that's a good movie. Okay. You sure? Did you guys see um, um, Saturday Morning Cartoons? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I wasn't in the Schoolhouse Rock. What? I like that. I was in the Fat Albert, uh, Bugs Bunny. Bill Cosby. Y'all dating? Yeah, <laughs> I like the Flintstones. You like the Flintstones were good. Yeah. Three Stooges. That was, was, that was during the week. Three Stooges was was during the week. Little Rascals. I didn't get into Little Rascals. You didn't, the, the Schoolhouse Rock. You yeah. didn't learn the. You didn't learn. A bill is a bill. Yeah, it's obvious I did. Capitol Hill. Uh, <laughs> time tables. On I was working. I was action. working. I was outside. Yeah. I was working. I was working at twelve. Yeah, I was Mr. Russell's. At yeah, was that Mr. Yeah, Russell's? I was yeah. working at twelve. What'd you so do, Mr. Time, Russell's? I'm, I was I box know. boy, ordering stuff and working the counter. Did you know and the preamble to the Constitution from Schoolhouse Rock. N- 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 yeah. Hey, check your tone, but no. Yeah, I'll ask you with love and a smile. There you go. I wouldn't. All right. Um, <laughs> next video. Um, remember back in the day? You nope. Did, <laughs> <laughs> We're not you, a mob. That you can drive a hoopty. Did any of you guys have what like a hoopty? Uh, yeah. Oh, car. I had, oh, yeah, I had yeah, a Pinto. Yeah. yeah. No, you I had, had a, one worse than that. What, what? You had the bus. Oh, you yeah, had a VW van, yeah, a bus. Yeah. Wagon. Yeah. That's what my mother had. We had yeah. one. Blue. Blue. Scooby Blue. Machine. White. Yep. Yeah. It seems like nowadays you don't hardly see people driving no. messed up cars. I still drive my 91 Ford Explorer. I had to drive a uh, ice cream truck. What? My mother had an ice cream truck and she turned it into a Bible bookstore. Oh, wow. Hilarious! And I, me and the homie had to drive it I to go, go to thing. a dance. <laughs> we went to a dance at Sarah High. <laughs> hey, it's my mama Bible bookstore. What the fuck? <laughs> we want to get saved. That's some pussy. <laughs> oh, wow! Oh my goodness! I'm All right, so here's a, a video. She had a speaker on there. I'm just saying that she had a speaker. On Catch there. me before I go to sleep. <laughs> Here's a video of the, somebody <laughs> driving a, a hoopie. Oh. Rapaz, eu já vi de tudo nessa vida, mas daqui eu vi ainda não, viu? Tá abastecendo, ó. Cheguei aqui no posto, olha aí, mano. Damn, olha man. a relíquia que anda todo tirado, viu? Olha aí, macho. They said in the car like what? Ô, oh, carnaval rei <laughs> doido, viu, menino? E os cabos aqui tá bem, olha aí, olha aí, olha aí. <laughs> He ripped the motor. Hey. <laughs> oh, <you're laughs> <for> gas, <laughs> baby. 
It ain't got no top. Hey, I'm off, amigo. I'm off that E85 right now. Out of the way. Yeah. Pablo, slow it down, fucker. Hey, fucker. Rapido. Ah. Motherfucker ain't went nowhere. <laughs> Now you can ride that in Oakland. <laughs> oh, no. Somebody oh. still steal it. <laughs> yeah, most definitely. Yeah, somebody yeah, will yeah. take that. <laughs> now you drove limos back. I used to drive. Yeah, limos. You used to drive limos. Yeah, that's what I did to when I was becoming a comedian because I, you know, you can't get no job. What were you looking for a subsidized? So did you see stuff in the limo? Uh, no, I met uh, um, uh, Don Cornelius' son through driving Tony. limos. Oh, yeah, Tony, 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 who didn't tip me. Mm. Oh, wow. uh, I had a chance to meet the girl from uh, Deuter. I mean, um, uh, she got to have it. The lead. I met her. Oh, driving yeah. limos. Did she uh, look? Did she, oh, she was she is sexy in, oh, in person? Oh my god, she was fine as fuck. So that's how I remember you because you used to come down. You used to park right in front of the Comic Theater. Mm -hmm. You used to come in, do your set, and you used to get back mm -hmm. down and you used to be hitting the road. Yeah. My high school friend was a, had a limo driver, had a limo server. Mm -hmm. So, so I, that was the one thing I did to make money, as mm -hmm. I was learning to do stand up because Lewis wouldn't help nobody out. <laughs> hmm. That's not true. That's true. I passed on true. all the information I got. I passed on to everyone that yeah, talked. Yeah, but you kept it to yourself. Yeah. All right. So I want to thank everybody who donated to the show oh, thank this you. week. Um, M. Willie. Thank you, M. Thank you, M. Willie. Pete, thank you, sir. Uh, Clemenza. Oh, uh, Pete. Dana Dorsey. Dana. Dana Dane. Fred Jones. Fred. Rel. Jackie W. Thank you, Jackie. Thank you, Jackie. And Jackie. Hey, you big see. girl, Jackie. Sound like it. Oh, wow. wow. Send us your there pictures. Those so are donations. Yeah, there you go. Oh, yeah. I meant that in a good way. She's beautiful. Yeah, she okay. is. She and beautiful. also to Jay. Thank you thank all you, for Jay. donating. Here's the information if you want to support the show. Also, um, um, share the link. Help us get our numbers up. And um, the show is good. Hey, do you my picture laugh? ever get on there? No, it doesn't. Oh, you yeah. You can, like, gotta, draw I, it in. I got to make a new one. <laughs> no, I don't have to do that. <laughs> no, I just put his picture from his segment in the corner. <laughs> 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 hey, real Lou. quick, I, I just want to say uh, thank you, Seymour and Jeff Brown, for calling in. And also, uh, we got to uh, meet Chris Weber. See, I saw Chris Weber yeah. last night. And See, Webb. You were scared where? to now, ask now, him to come on the show. Here's the thing. At where? At the Miracle Theater. Oh, okay. So yeah. he's going to come on the show because mm -hmm. Jeff more or less bogarted. No, I, I wasn't going to invite. All right, what happened? I just went up to him and I just introduced myself. I said, yo. I like you. Yeah, no, I, I like this game and I was just like, yeah, you we talk. Have a, we have a podcast. No, no, tell him what you first you said and how you introduced him. Hey, you know, I've been doing comedy with Louis Dix. I've been his friend for 30 years. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, yo, he doesn't want to invite you on the podcast. So would you like, and then he said, you know what? I would love to come, but I'm offended and insulted because Lewis wouldn't ask me. Mm -hmm. And if he would ask me, yes, I will come. And you wouldn't ask him. Oh, my God. But he's going to come. Let me say this. He Remember has a bunch of he was, he was supposed to go have a meeting with that dude? Because he was doing his foxhole. And I actually had a meeting with him. Yeah. And <laughs> I don't know if I should have invited you, but he, he made dinner See spaghetti. How he was? See? No, and that's that's the loose dicks. Yeah, that's the loose yeah. dicks. No, we were supposed to have dinner with him because he was trying to put together a show. Yeah, we had the C web, the spider web thing, and right. Uh, uh, yes, yeah. and and um, so uh, and also a friend of mine, uh, Coach Todd Davis. I used to coach at Burbank High School. Really nice guy. Is he gonna he come on the show? Away. No, he oh. passed away. <laughs> Uh, he can't come on away. the show. So he with your daughter. <laughs> oh, oh, I say it. And oh, well, did he die in his sleep? No. <laughs> uh, uh, um, hmm? F you. Jeff said he'd be here in five minutes. F you, cancer. He oh, died no. of cancer. Sorry to hear that. Oh, okay. And to everyone that's lost, someone, and that was your coach. No, he was one of. He was the guy that I, that I coached against. Oh, okay, his gotcha. son was a good player, and he, he. Last time I saw him, he was coaching at Burbank High School. I got a text today saying. That Todd so he coached, Davis. He coached the girls team up in heaven now. There you go. Sydney might have a chance. Sydney, bring him out. <laughs> bring him out. Bring him out. So uh and and again. Take your I baby wanna, clothes off. I want to apologize, even though I'm sure the young lady's not listening. And the Christian clouds take on the devils of the underground. Now, I'm sure she won't come back. Heavenly on again. basketball game here. Uh, I'm sure she won't come back on again. Who's that? Who? Sydney? No. <laughs> she, uh, TDP's friend. What was her name? Basket oh. by crib death. <laughs> oh, cool. Hey, hey, hey. What's her name? Leia by stillborn. <laughs> Yo. Yo. 
Jump her by pancreatitis. Umbilical cord to the baseline. Hey, hey, man, come on now. That is not that funny. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> what was the girl's name? Uh, Aaron. Stop. Aaron. Now, what does she do? Uh, Aaron's just cool as fuck. Well, she's not. not now. She has to do something. Right? What does she do? <sighs> Can't just be cool. Yeah, is she a just comedian? Cool. No, 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 no. Well, What's her profession? She she she's a personal assistant. Uh, is that the young lady that was sitting there? She well, she didn't get a chance to sit. She was <laughs> pretty she's much a personal her. assistant. Yeah. So why would she come uh, on the show? She's good friends with us, with Tita and me. She's done my show before. We really got. And what did she bring one, to the table? Apparently nothing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Not death. <laughs> Thank you, Speedy. Here's the butcher son meme. Oh, there's wow. meat in, in the, the air. air. Oh, oh wow. wow. I have my locks. Oh. What's her name again? Three Finger Pictures present. Karen Styles. <laughs> Karen Styles? Aaron. Oh, Aaron Styles. With an E. Okay, Aaron Styles. Um, I apologize. For what? I don't know. Me and Lewis. Yeah, be to yourself. Um, right. That was interesting to see you react that way. What? That was. What? Oh, I was here. I saw it in real time. <laughs> what way? It was the Lewis well, we I knew. A little too far. It was the Lewis oh, I knew you mean, back in the day. Oh, you mean you talking about when you went to Sydney? Yeah, yeah that was that, that wasn't funny. I feel like Danny now. <laughs> I feel like, we need a lisp. I feel that. like I want to lay down in the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> On that note, uh, we'll see oh, you stop, guys. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> wow, look. That, that, that was he wasn't listening. Wow. <laughs> no way Danny listened to that part. Not to the end. <laughs> wow, look. Oh.